Warning! New background in three, two, one. Kikariki! Oh hi! Ah, Kikariki! Hello, welcome! Wow, wow, wow! That's loud. I guess we should. Welcome to the new room. It's it's my room and it's the girls' room. I bring the girls over and we do Ooh. girls talk here. Yay! Yay! Oh, Hello. this is a good room to be a girl in. Right? Well, actually, mm -hmm. I say this is the first time I'm showing it. So let's just you know go down ah. a little bit. <laughs> and, Don't and just, on my leg. Just look. Okay, so. On the left side, we have a girly bed <laughs> with a croissant. Croissant, exactly. <laughs> uh, and some some memories on the wall, uh, and a cute calendar, and a cute picture from the Freddy reveal. A cute window mm. with cute curtains, and then a cute mm, wardrobe with a cute aquarium. Why you got a caution tape on your aquarium? Because <laughs> the frog has to be in there and cannot be taken out at any cost, unless you mean with taking out to kill her. Um, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> that would be okay. Um, yeah, yeah, uh, and this and that. And uh, there's uh, one of my chicken paintings. I like to paint my um, KFP members uh, naked in my past. Nice dancer. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Uh, a cat uh, tree, uh, some more stuff, makeup table, you know, this and that. Oh, there's even a tiara figure on top of the shelf on the right side. I don't know if you guys can see. Oh, yeah, and a photo of yourself? Or is that Kelly? I That's me, my painting of uh, Kelly. I drew that in. <gasps> oh. But I drew it in Passport 2. Oh, the game. Oh yeah, your art in Passport Two is <laughs> so nice. It's so yeah, good. yeah. I got pretty we're not have into been able it. To tell. <laughs> and then we are oh. right now at uh, <clears throat> Kotatsu. Yeah. Oh wait, go, <gasps> to go down, go down. Oh. <laughs> I have a question. Yes. Oh, you have like two pairs of the same shorts because I noticed the shorts that you should be wearing now are on the bed. Uh huh. Well, mm. we're, we're having a comfortable time right now, so I'm wearing pajama pants. Okay. Mm -mm. It's just oh, I, I get it. No <laughs> pants. It's the streamer thing. I mean, who here is wearing really what they should be wearing underneath, eh? Not I. Mm. That's mm -hmm. what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> no pants at the Kotatsu. <laughs> yes. Yes. Otherwise, I don't know. It, it gets so hot down there. Your clothes may catch fire. Uh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Or you don't want sweaty legs. Mm -hmm. Ew. Although, no. It's, Ew. It doesn't get that, that sweaty. You, you can oh. change the temperature anyway. Oh, but yeah. Oh, uh, what? Band pants. Hmm. Except pajama uh, pants. Pajama pants are okay. Yeah. Pajama pants are very girly. Yes. So long as they're not <laughs> fleece. Because getting sweaty in fleece pajamas is the worst Ooh. experience. Mm. Or getting out of a hot shower into fleece pajamas is also a terrible experience. Getting mm. sweaty fleece. in leather pants is also not good. <laughs> Doesn't that make it hard to, to take pants if it's leather? Don't you... Don't they have to like... Baby powder before you put leather stuff on? Uh, Did you oil I yourself? think that's mostly with like latex. That's when it gets real serious. Oh. <laughs> what? You have to prep to wear pants? For latex? Yeah. yeah. For latex, you have to prep. I think. Yeah, like oil <laughs> yourself up to slide into the latex. What? <laughs> that must feel like so that. gross. What? Yeah. Yeah. No. Think of the reaction you could have too. Because there's nowhere for your skin to breathe. You have a layer and then mm. latex. And I'm... Yes. Icky. Not, not good for <laughs> skin, maybe. But uh, we, 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 before we get going, uh, let's introduce our girl, our new girl. <laughs> Who is uh -huh. this girl? Who are a girl. you? I am a real girl. <gasps> Whoa. Hello. Hi, KFP. I'm back. Yay! Um, <laughs> it's been a week. <laughs> Welcome to your Hi. sub channel. <laughs> Hi, I'm Gooba. I'm back. Hello, everybody. <laughs> hey, girl. Hi, girl. Hi, girl. Hi, girl. Good. Hi, girl. What, what makes you a girl? <laughs> mm. I don't know. I'm feeling intimidated all of a sudden by the other girls here. I'm nervous. <laughs> <laughs> Why am I nervous? 
But what I... makes me a girl? Yeah. You have something that you think hmm. make, makes you very girly? Girly? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, not that... I don't know. <laughs> so I don't know how to answer <laughs> that. <laughs> mm. I don't know how to answer that. Hmm. Well, I can I can say mm, the ribbons on your cute twin tails make you very girly right now. Oh yeah, I guess so. Cute. Having twin tails, ribbons are having cute. a ribbon. Oh. oh, I don't know what you call it, but the way your sleeves are, that's girly. Like, frills, not oh, frills. Like, ruff is it frills? Ruffles. ruffles. Is it ruffle? Ruffle, yeah. Mm. Ruffle is cute. Yeah. Mm. Mm hmm. Oh. Wait, was it was it gonna what 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 was I gonna say? I was gonna say something about Kura. Wait, uh oh. What makes her a girl? Nah, not that. But anyway, no. yeah. So Kura is here. Okay. <laughs> we are having girls talk with Kura. Uh, normally, uh -huh. it was planned to be like you know a thing with me, Mume, and Fana, and then we would get a guest in. But uh, Fana is on a break, and now. Uh, you know, Gura... Ah, that's what I wanted to say. Gura, oh, like, has been um, giving me signs of wanting to be in Girls Talk oh, for a while yeah. now. <laughs> right? Put me in, put me in, put me in. Yes, you are here now. And you are taking uh, up almost the position of Fauna for today. So hopefully you can bring a, uh, a lot of, like, girliness here. <laughs> Girly oh, yes. I've, I've been I so just... excited for this. Mm. Can, can I just say, no offense, Gura, mm -hmm. uh -oh. but you are surprisingly very girly. Oh, what? You... <laughs> You're very you... like I because I took a peek at what you what we will show later. I was like, oh, that's oh. pretty, that's pretty <laughs> girly. Mm -hmm. What do you think? I thought I was because I saw what you guys were put. Uh, what you guys posted last time? I was like, whoa. They're so. Well, they have so many products. I don't know what I'm doing. Mm. Oh, I. I don't. I mean, I just kind of added more than I usually yeah. use. But, oh, but another okay. thing that also made me realize is I was with Fauna in Japan and we went to a store and she was like, "Oh, Gura really likes this store," and it was the girliest store I've ever been in. <laughs> Which store? Fana! Which store? Are you ready me out? Which one? <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> It was very girly. Does Gura remember? Really cute. Uh, no, Gura does not remember. Do you really <laughs> not remember? What kind of store was it? No, I do remember because I remember when I was hanging out with Fauna. We started talking about like boutiques and stuff, and especially in Japan, like Liz Lisa and Aunt Rouge, etc. Uh. Et uh -huh. And I was like, oh, oh there's so Liz Lisa. Might have been. <gasps> was Something it? similar. It was similar. To, I know what Liz Lisa is. I think it was similar to that. So it was a clothing store, though? Yeah, they're mm. the Japanese clothing boutiques. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. They have so many cute things. I used to wear Lisa Lisa uh. and Ankuruju all the time. Oh, they're <laughs> so cute. Yeah. Their um, bags are so cute. Yo, yes. 100%. But I feel like if you like Liz Lisa bags, I think you would also really like Samantha Tabasha <gasps> bags. You know? Oh my god. When we were in Japan, I remember oh. we walked by and I was like, Oh my god. Yes, Leave yes. me here for the next three days. Yes, yes, yes. With the hearts, with the ruffles. Mm -hmm. I really like, like the, the Valentine's design. Day collection. Yeah. <laughs> I just bought one of their mm. bags recently. Last time I was in Japan. A really pretty <gasps> bag. <yeah. laughs> oh. Now I don't feel like a girl. Because oh. I'm... I don't... I don't... Really... Okay. Hmm. I get it, but also don't get bags and shoes. Wow. Bags and what? shoes. Do you not need no bags? Shoes? No, I wear shoes, but like I don't get to how people get have so many pairs. They're like, this is perfect for this outfit. Like, Ooh, wait, just, just get how a pair of shoes that's white. A pair of shoe that is white or black, and it goes it goes with anything. Okay, but one I, moment, Gura. How many huh? shoes do you think roughly you own? Uh. Count in your brain. Mume, you do the same. Four. Four? No <laughs> fucking way. I have four, but Dang. I need to get a new pair because my... The main shoes I you wear mean, you are falling apart. You at least mean four pairs of shoes, right? Not not four single shoes, oh. right? Oh yeah, four pairs. Mm. So I have two that I mostly wear. A white pair and a black pair. And then I have boots for when it rains. <gasps> and I have... Like, um, kind of like hiking shoes. Four, so, four pairs of <laughs> shoes for the whole year? Yes. Oh my god. I... I go... Okay. 
Um, I did you not notice in Japan I wore the same pair of shoes? No, I didn't notice. <laughs> Uh, I, I wear the same that. pair every day. I mean, I mean, for traveling, I, I understand not bringing like oh. too many shoes with you, you know? Mm. Mm. That's a good point. That's a good, good idea. Do you remember the number? Do you know? Uh, I was counting in my head, and I think at the moment I have only like 10 or so. Which only is okay. It's it not, seems like I have not... the most. <laughs> <laughs> I think I have like probably. Around 30? <laughs> what? Where do you store them? I don't... Where, how do you store them? Well, I have a shoe case and then I have some more shoes like stored away that are like kind of off-season right now that I don't wear in the uh, current I season. See. Oh, I got well, a new pair. Of 11 I... then. I well, I have 11? Mm. Oh. I have five. I have a pair I never uh, wear. Oh! But they, they're... Count they're it! Cute. Count it! Do it! <laughs> yeah, they're the cutest pair of shoes I have and I never wear them. But, what do they look like? Mm. Wait, mm. roughly. Like, stop. Oh, it was sandal <laughs> boot. Pat <laughs> at explaining. They're like... They have some... They're... Um, shoot, I don't know how to explain it. It's like boot, but not boot. It has a little heel. I don't know how to walk Booty. in heels. So maybe it has fluff around like the... Cute. Hot. Heart. Oh. It's br they're brown. Mm. I think we call them booties. Booties? booties? Like little, little cute, little short, tiny. Wait, I got booties. Are we booties. talking about? We're not talking about Uggs, right? No, not Uggs. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. They're no, no, no. on Uggs. Oh my god, I want back. to know. Uggs, Mumba, Uggs yes or no? <laughs> Uggs will come back. They had. I swear, Uggs. Yeah. Pretty yes, often. No problem with that, in my opinion. For like. Like middle school, everyone had them, so I got them. They're comfy. Uh huh. You know, kind of gross. They get dirty like really fast. <laughs> but you could put yeah. your phone in them if you got the tall ones. You could fit like pencils. Uh, and I don't phone. like the tall ones. I only like the really Why? short ones. The short uh, ones are cute, mm. and especially the ones that have like a little ribbon in the back. You know which ones? Yes. Those are cute, right? Those are cute. Mm. Mm. But yeah, once you get like some rain on them or so, they will stain. Mm. It's pretty bad. Yeah, they get gross. Mm. Like, yeah. I'd have to walk to mm. school and stuff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, other people do. Like, everyone's Uggs just would get. Like, now that I think about it, they yeah. get dirty and they're hard to clean. Yeah. And then the, the fluff inside gets worn down the more you wear them, and then it just kind of. Like, gets really mm. gross. Mm. Yeah, it does. Like, it loses the. Like comfiness, because it's, yeah, it just becomes flat. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And there's no support. I always need a, mm. a new pair of Uggs every year. <laughs> Ooh, I can remember shoes that were really popular oh. before, but now I don't know any brands. Like Toms were popular. <laughs> oh oh you know my god! Are? I remember Toms. You remember Toms? Yeah. Toms. Oh, what do they look the like? Pair of shoes. Mm. Are they the canvas sneakery type thing? Ah. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Speaking of shoes that used to be popular, you know, like maybe mm, ten years ago or so, uh, some shoes that I used to love to wear was like um, shoes that mm, basically look like a sneaker, but they have they have some platform heels. <laughs> wow! Um, I feel like maybe that. You, you could still what? see that somewhere nowadays. But the type that I had was like, I think nowadays you wouldn't see anymore. Because it wasn't like oh. the same platform height throughout the whole shoe. No, like the heel was higher. I used to wear something like that. Uh, platform <laughs> sneaker. Yeah, platform sneaker. But Weird. like as a. But not flat. Heel. Not flat. Pl platform. And the heel was even higher. How high, 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 I'm not. Oh, but, those are ouchy. There's, however, Mama, they look if ouchy. you say you can't walk in them, but there's certain types of heels that are way easier to wear than others. Like for example, pumps. Um, I can't, <gasps> I can walk or dance in those unless they have a strap on, ah. around the ankle. 
Without, uh. I'm, I'm fucked too. But platform yeah. heels are like... The, the, especially the, 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 chub, the club, clubby chubby. What do you call them? Chunky. Chunky ones, yeah. Chunky heels are... I think they look super cute and they're easy to walk in too. Kitten heels huh. are cute. With the little tiny... Those are like the little tiny, tiny lift, right? It's time for Google. Kitten, Kitten heels? heels? <laughs> yeah! Kitten right? heels? Oh! Yeah, yeah, these are like, yeah. yeah, cute. Oh. Like, these look like you'd wear them to work in an office. Yeah. I've never heard that word before, but okay, now to hold on. This looks awful. Wait, hold on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't know. This looks, this looks like an injury waiting to happen. Oh, oh that, that's a heel, yeah. Uh, I, I've never eee, worn those, those kind of shoes ugly. before. I wonder if they're easy to wear. <laughs> well, I'll just... I, I can't really show it, I guess. I don't know where you got that picture from. <laughs> oh, I just looked up kitten heels. Mm, oh, oh yeah, look bad. up kitten heels and look for a red pair that comes up like it. I don't know. It looks weird. Mm. Wow, 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 wow. Guys, girls, girls, not guys. <laughs> girls. <Yes. laughs> I, need yeah. to, I need to change my habit of saying guys. I always say that. Mm. Well... Um, we have like uh, accelerated a little bit too fast. We need to talk about something first of all, okay? Ah, oh. sorry. We have to hold back a little bit. First things <laughs> first. Uh, <laughs> Toron, Toron, we have to talk about good ah. things to see if she's like, you know, qualified to be here. <laughs> My stuff. Do I qualify as a girly girl? <laughs> Well, I mean, honestly, I wouldn't even say that this necessarily will give us any, you know, not the qualifications or not qualifications or so. But, you know, you know, uh, it's something I want to talk about. Me and Bume and Fauna in the last Girls Talk episode talked in a, a, a very lengthy. We talked about skincare and makeup routines. Yeah. Mm. So I got Gura to as a homework bring oh. hers as well and show them to us so we can discuss. I have a question for Gura after she shows her makeup. I have also questions. Oh Please <laughs> remind oh me. I have a question. Oh god. Oh god. What do you oh want to start with, Gubriba? Let's do skincare because I'm more of a skincare girly than okay. a makeup girly. Oh, okay. Yeah. That is true. Okay. <gasps> Let's talk about this. Could you start maybe from left to right or so? Okay, so I really I like the Tatcha brand. Mm. Um, Tatcha really works well for my skin. I use the dewy, the the dewy. That's the cream on the left. It's very thick and good for like. When do you put it on? Stuff. Um, usually every night, but sometimes just throughout the day if I need it and I'm and it's around, I'll put some on. Mm -hmm. Like if you have like a dry spot or dry zones on your skin, it's really good for that. Mm. Um, and then that's the, the, the wash in the middle that is like a lightly exfoliating. A little goes a long way as I've learned, uh, oh. which is really nice. Yes, yes. Um, and it's gentle. Sometimes I think it's too gentle, but maybe I just like to be rough with my skin. Oh, yes, yes. Uh, but then as you wash it with the middle one and then on the right is a serum, you wash it and then you serum and then you put the moisturizer on afterwards. Mm. Ah. And the serum is also to plump the skin and keep it moist and springy, boingy, boingy. So mm. the serum and and the, the 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 cleaning thingy, you use that every day. Yeah. Mm. Unless no. I'm too tired and I just go to bed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Okay, okay. Th I like those uh. products. I've never seen those before, but they look cute. I like the purple. They're nice. They're really, really They're nice. Fancy. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And then this really uh, confused me. All of Volaplex, <laughs> I only know from hair stuff. <laughs> I got because because I don't know. I was like, well, skincare, my routine. I usually do hair when I do mm, skin as well. And then this is the Olaplex uh -huh. is just like uh, the golden one is a, a bonding oil. I oh. think it's called, but it's just good for I think pretty much any hair type and it oh. just keeps it smooth and you put and oil in your hair stuff. it's good for you though have you ever heard of putting like moroccan oils in your hair or yeah mm -hmm. yeah, uh, yeah other stuff like that but is it like really fish good. oil for you gura fish oil fish oil <laughs> no that would be stinky <laughs> not that i would mind it oh what does this one smell like that goes in your mouth yeah fish oil wasn't 
I've never had fish oil though. Like omega, omega three capsules. Ah, yeah. Is that, is no that fish, fish oil in there? Oh. Did no, you open it? <laughs> it's in a capsule. Ooh. It is also in your belly though. I give them to my animal too. Yummy. Wait, you take mm, fish oil? Mm, I used to, but now I don't. Mm. Is, it, is it good for your skin? Oh, not for skin. I forgot what it does, but... <laughs> oh. What Apparently, it can, it can be good for joints. Mm. It's good for Ooh. joints. Mm. Mm, but not, not on the skin. Ah, and it's not good for animal skin. fur. Apparently. Yes, Ooh. yes, yes. For, yeah. Interesting. Well, you, you guys know three. some stuff, but that's not necessarily girly. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Um, <laughs> no, it's okay. Uh, well, we can talk about that too, but... <laughs> I... I have a question. So I used to try putting products in my hair like mm, that. Uh -huh. Not that one, but ones like, out, like after the shower, you know, it says apply on damp hair. Mm. It always leaves my hair super greasy. Mm -hmm. And I follow the instructions. Study. It's the wrong yeah, product for your hair type. It's the wrong mm. stuff. Oh. Not a whole dust? I don't know what my hair type is. <laughs> but I don't it's think like... your hair type is the one that Gura has. From looking no. at you girls, I think your hair types are a different kind mm. of... I have brown hair. Yes. Yes, hair type. Girl's hair. <laughs> yeah, but hair not, the color, not the color. Not the color. The, like, you know, <laughs> the thickness and all that. And the yeah. mm, texture. I don't well, know. Yeah, it depends. It all depends. Mm. That's why I think Olaplex is... I mean, I don't know. Mm. That's why you maybe can get samples if you want to try it. But, but yeah, yeah it, it's... <laughs> That's the problem with like skincare and makeup is that yeah. you never know if it's gonna work for you and you can't exactly, exactly. use it and yeah. return it. Exactly. So. I have like three different products that I wanted that I tried that made my hair greasy. I don't know what to do with them. Mm. <laughs> exactly. It's like, a maybe long they'll work later. <laughs> of testing and testing and testing. But for Olaplex, I know at least that they're they have a really good reputation from like their dyeing pro hair dyeing product. So mm. so I I would trust. The brand, at least. Is the left thing a shampoo or what is that? Oh, the thing on the left is what you use, I think, for damp hair. It just speeds up drying and it's mm -hmm. good if you want to style oh. it afterwards. If you use like... Uh, like if you... I don't know if you guys do... Uh, blowouts after you shower or like... When blowouts? You're, blowouts? Is you give yourself a, oh, a you blowout? Mean, you mean when, you're the, going... when the hairdresser goes like really close with the hairdryer to your hair yeah. and goes like straight oh, does it down? Give volume? Does yeah, it give yeah. volume? Oh, I never dry my hair. <laughs> oh, I mean, oh. I never used to, but then I started and now it's, hair drying. it's a good habit. Mm. Mm. It makes the hair look so pretty, but it's kind of too much effort, so I don't, I don't <laughs> dry it like that. I usually shower at night, so... Mm. Oh, but then you go to bed with a wet head. Uh. And then your pillows um, get wet. Well, uh. well, I don't shower yeah. before bed. I like shower, then I stay up for like another hour or so. Mm. So it's um, already dry by then. Yeah, it sucks going to bed with wet hair. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. True, true. So you put this in there because you also do it kind of daily? Oh, not daily. I think I've just gotten into the habit. But mm. mostly when I when I style the hair, then I definitely do the leave-in. But then you also need to do a heat protectant. You always have to use a heat protectant. Mm -hmm. And then mm -hmm. another thing you always have to use is sunscreen, which is the next item. Ah, I always put on a nice daily cream. sunscreen. Yeah, mm. important. But I, I, I mean, do... I don't go out much, and when I go out, I mean, I only in summer I put on some sunscreen. Mm. Yeah, mm. I got a really I bad have... sunburn not too long ago, so I've definitely ah. made sure to do it every day now. Oh wait, I, have... I think I've heard about your sunburn. Oh my god, that was bad. I wanted to die. <laughs> oh, did it peel? Did, did, did you peel it? Yes, I was like a snake. Yes, was like peely, flaky, crispy, yes. crunchy. Yes. <laughs> I left my DNA uh, everywhere. Mm. That was my favorite part of having a really awful sunburn. Mm. It feels it's nice cool. to peel it off, doesn't it? Yeah, it's satisfying. Mm -hmm. Well, because what I did was uh, I put on a a long sleeve sweatshirt, like a heat heat tech shirt. Afterwards, which was a mistake because what heat tech does for it to work is it captures your body heat and your sweat and keeps it inside the shirt mm. to keep you warm. Mm. 
But I didn't realize that I am severely sunburnt, and by me putting on a long sleeve, it's going to capture that sweat and then keep it in my skin. So... Mm. That sounds disgusting somehow. It felt like I was pulling <laughs> fabric off my skin. It was really intense. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, you melted the... the you melted the fabric into your skin. No, my skin was the fabric and it essentially Ooh. just melted off Ooh. the wall. <laughs> Not good. Be more careful. No, no, no sunburn, please. No more. Wear your careful. sunscreen. Mm -hmm. But what? then, my last item is yeah. the Elizabeth Arden 8 hour. And this is good for like... Uh, if you guys get dry lips in the night, I always put this on my lips, like, before bed, and it just oh. keeps them moist. Mm -hmm. It's a lip also, balm? I think you can use it in multiple places. It's kind of got the consistency of, like, Vaseline. Mm. So, I've used it on my hands, I've used it on my lips, I've used oh. it on, like, if I have a dry spot that's annoying, I just put it on, and then I, I wake up moist. Oh, yeah. Oh. Hey, Mumei, do, do you do lip cream, lip balm, or something like that? Because I don't. Lips. Um, I have something that I've rarely used. I actually used it last night, but <gasps> no, I have very bad habits with my lips. <laughs> Me too. I, oh, internet robot, Mumei. <laughs> <laughs> Mumei. Yes. Ah, you're good again. You're good again. It was just for a moment, robot Mumei. <laughs> oh, oh. It's okay. I, I do you mean you peel it off? Because I always peel it off. I, I wish I could stop. I, I, I used to have, yeah, I used to have a really bad lip biting habit. Biting? Oh, mm, but well, I'd bite them and pull them. It was bad. I chew on it. It was pretty bad. <laughs> but what, what makes it's not you, so bad now? What makes you want to bite it? Like I can't relate. What makes you want to bite your lips? Oh, I just don't... I don't think about it. It just has to oh, there. It's... Like... Mm, I feel like it happened a lot when I was in school, which is even worse. Because mm. <laughs> it's like in public, but I wouldn't really notice that I was doing it. Oh, mm. I bite my lips in public. Wait, is that bad? <laughs> no, like... Okay, I don't know how to explain... It was not just like a little nibble, like... Oh, no, 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 no. Like, you know, it was bad. Like, Ooh. I used to... I don't... I don't oh, win. It didn't hurt though. It was just gross. I don't know why I did it. What good are you bite your lips too? Lip. Yeah, I like chew all the skin off that comes off. I don't know if you caught me doing it, but no. It, so you peel oh. it by biting. Oh. Yeah, sometimes if I got a good peel go, and then I'll just like suck on it to make it soft, and then I'll just chew it off. What? Mm. I didn't know such a technique. I just rip it off discreetly. <laughs> yeah, because then if you rip it off, it's gonna like. Mm, I'm careful of it. I mean, <laughs> leaves marks and stuff. Mm. Mm, but I wouldn't just bite like I bite like the inside of my mouth too. Oh. So it was just oh. it was just nasty on purpose. No, I didn't realize. I don't realize when I do. It's kind of like oh. um, I don't know. Do you ever like shake your leg or something, or when you're sitting, yeah. or just stuff you don't do unconsciously? Mm. <laughs> Mm. I, I wasn't mm. on purpose. I just mm. did so now, it. now you don't do it anymore. That's good for you. No, not really. Good for Sometimes you. Peel. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes I'll still peel. <laughs> peel, peel it if it's dry, but mm. that's okay. Mm. I recently actually talked about this on my stream. Uh, revealed my bad habits, and a lot of people were like, "I have this too. I have this too." Actually, like it felt like ninety nine percent of the chat was saying, "Me too. Me too." So. <gasps> We're all the same. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Seems like we all have some kind of lip habit. <laughs> it's okay. Yummy. That's it's like nice. me, for real, for real. Usually when I'm trying to see if chat can relate to something I do, they just go, Mume, that's so weird. What? Hey, that's so weird. <laughs> they do it too. They got to. No doubt they do it too. Or they <laughs> did it too. Hmm, or, yeah. Not me, streamer weird. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, we're done with the skincare, so let's move on to the makeup. I'm curious about Goody uh, Bell's makeup, because when I, when I, you know, looked at uh, you up close, I never noticed make makeup. Did I? I am Why? not a makeup girly. Were you wearing oh, oh, makeup at the times we were, we were together? Sometimes. Mm. Isn't it? There's a, there's a, a name for 
it not not natural look, but there's I, I know there's a girl a clean girl. That's what it is. Clean <laughs> girl. Are you a clean girl? No. What? Wait, is, is that but what they call skin. it? What? Clean girl, I think, is like you really focus on your oh. skin. Oh. Your skincare, so you don't need to wear foundation or concealer or anything oh. usually. Like you maybe just wear mascara. But then they do something kind of weird with their eyebrows. I don't really they get like, that. They put they like they make them really thick and they comb them with gel to make them yeah! really Yeah! Like, wow! Oh, really so that really that belongs yeah. to clean girls? That's a clean girl thing? I think so. Okay. Yeah. Good and do that, but I think her skin was very clean when I saw it. Mmm. Why thank you? Mm. So, okay, let's look at this. Cute, it's oh all God. pink. Goody <laughs> it's all pink. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Tell me. Um, so starting on the left, that is mascara. It's mm -hmm. very nice. From Dior. Like it is. It's their curl something. Is it good? Ultra curl. Because I'm it's always good. looking like for it. a good mascara. Like, mascara is like, oh my God, there's so much hit <gasps> and miss. Yes. Mm -hmm. More miss than I... hit. I like it. Um, it depends on what style of eyelash you look. Yeah, you like, mm. sorry. Cause like mm. some girls really like the the spider leggy where it's really clumpy and stuck together but and you some know. prefer yeah. <laughs> the more yeah, like the more spread out version, I guess. Like mm. separating. <laughs> Does that mm. make sense? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I know what I'm you're really, talking about. I'm like picky with how my eyelashes look. Like I'll try and separate it in a certain way. Whoa. Or like you you apply more. What is the technique? You apply more on the edges to elongate or something. Uh-huh. Like uh -huh. Yeah. I don't know much about that, but uh anyway, next product mm -hmm. is uh it's like a tinted lip balm. Thingy. Also from Dior. Mm -hmm. It's very nice. I like natural lip colors because whenever I put on a, <laughs> a lip color that is too different from my natural lip color, I feel weird. Like, I feel like it looks wrong. So mm -hmm. I just like to stick to really neutral, natural colors. Yeah, I think that's really... good. Yeah. So, yeah. And then the, this is the Benefit Dandelion uh, highlighter, but it's a really, really, I don't know, really neutral color. Is it just one color or shimmer. more colors? Yeah. It's just one color. It's like a really pretty pearly pink. And you can use it on your cheeks and your nose. Or you can use it on your eyes as well. Because mm -mm. I don't really like... I don't mess with eyes. I can't use eyeliner. I don't know how to use eyeshadow. So I just keep it really easy. Maybe I'll teach you. I need a lesson because I can't do I'm an it. eyeliner pro. Yo. Oh, so many times in my yeah. life I've been uh, like... Appraised uh, for my on fleek <gasps> eyeliner. Mm -hmm. mm. I did. I remember commenting on it because I was like, Your eyeliner oh, yeah. is amazing. Mm -hmm. There you go. And that wasn't even like one of my good days. That was one of my <gasps> worst days. <laughs> like, you yeah. and Crony are really good at eyeliner. Thank you. Yeah, I've heard that before. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> mm. yeah. I'm proud. I've practiced for so long with eyeliner. Um, it is so hard. Mm. I can't do it. And if I do I, it on one side, I can't replicate it. Ah. And, mm -hmm. I go with like the smudge look because I don't. I used ah. to try doing like you know the more like dark mm -hmm. shade or I don't know what you call it, but yeah, I used to try doing that. Then I stopped. Now I don't know how to do it anymore. So now oh. I like go with or I use eyeshadow sometimes. If that makes eyeshadow sense. Eyeshadow is good. Yeah. It's I not, I don't know if it's eyeliner or if it's just, I, I don't know. Well, do you but, do like the tight lining? Is that what it's called? I don't know. I, is that when you like do your, your, your waterline? Yeah. No. Oh, no, no, no. I don't do waterline. I, I mean, used either. to. That's so scary to me. That's one thing I can't really do. Blech. I used to do. <laughs> 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 Scary. I, that, I, I did that when I first started learning how to do makeup. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's scary. I think I tried I before, know. but I think I did it not with black though, but with white because I was like mm. many, many years ago, I was getting like into Japanese makeup and fashion and all that. And uh -huh. um, yeah, not not quite Gyaru at all, but Ooh. somewhere in that direction. And I, I noticed they do like white uh, eye oh. uh, thingies because they want to make their eyes even bigger. I tried that. Mm. But, mm. Did you use circle lenses too? Have any of you used circle lenses? Yes. <laughs> I've, I've used, used them. <laughs> I've used them too, mm. but really? not very much. Like, 
Mm, when you say circle lens, do you just mean contacts that change your eye color a bit? No. Circle lenses uh, are contact color contact lenses that focus on the outer circle. They give you a bigger circle outside. It's not much about the color. Some have like a little bit of color too. But it's mostly just because of the outer circle. It makes it bigger. So those are... They're a little bit more uncomfortable to wear than other lenses. Because they're even bigger. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I think scary. I... Mm. I think I have worn these before. Mm -hmm. They just... They weren't that big. But mm. they were bigger than my, my irises. Oh, they're, and they're not sclera lenses. There's some that are crazier called sclera oh, lenses. Oh, no, 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 not that. No, no, under no. your eyelid. You not have to, like, that much. Pull your eyelid up to slide them under. Oh my god, that reminds me. My, one of my friends, um, who also like uses like uh, lenses and all that, she once had one go behind the like back there. Uh, yeah, and she freaked uh, out, and somehow she managed to get it back. But that was really fucking dangerous because you fucked when that happens. You absolutely. F ah, have, sorry. Have, <laughs> have I? I told sorry, have I, I triggered I myself. <laughs> oh, I'm about to trigger you more. Have you? Uh, um, have I shown you or talked about a video where this woman would fall asleep in her contacts uh, oh and just uh, sit and like just. I don't know, would wake up and not think about where they went. Like, she thought they fell out when she was sleeping or something. Mm -hmm. And she went to the eye doctor. And they were, like, <laughs> behind. Like, they had to lift her eyelid. And they pulled out, like, <laughs> throw up. 20, 20 <laughs> contact lenses. <laughs> and they were discolored and... <laughs> How do you fall asleep with contact lenses? How do you not feel mm, that? I've done that before, but I've um, like I just wake up with really dry eyes and like, Ugh, and then I take I've them out. No, it's really bad. It's, heard, you, should, you should not. Like the ones that I used to wear, like circle lenses or whatever. You're not supposed to have them on overnight, but apparently, like some lenses, you know, that are just for, uh, for exchange of uh, glasses. Some of those you oh. can wear overnight, right? I've ever, I've heard. There are, I think there are yeah. some, but the type I use, you, you're not supposed to. <laughs> mm -hmm. So please mm. don't. <laughs> it would be nice though. I always wondered what's it like to wake up and not be blind. Oh. Oh god. Uh, you can. Unless, I guess you can get your eyes lasered. Some dream. people do that. A friend of yeah. mine did that. Yeah. You, you have to wait until your eyes stop changing and mine keep changing. Oh. So. Yeah, oh. I think do they, they get, keep need on getting to, worse. We get worse, yeah. <gasps> They're supposed Yay. to. I think you have to wait until they stop changing for two years or something. <sighs> or maybe a year. Interesting. But mm, it is. My mom had the same. Like her eyes just kept getting worse and worse and worse. Mm. And then eventually they stopped, and she, like immediately she got the, <laughs> the laser eye surgery. Okay. She well, she had like the worst vision you could have. I hope you can so... get it someday, even though it seems very scary. Yeah. Oops, mm. I want it. I just want to wake up. I feel like it'd be very motivating to wake up and like be able to see. Yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah. <gasps> Lying down watching TV, you don't have to adjust your stupid glasses. Oh. Mm. <laughs> well, you know, an amusement park and wearing the 3D goggles without having to adjust <gasps> your glasses. Uh, I don't have that issue, uh. but I've heard of it. Yes, yes. <laughs> Oh gosh, I once I went to get my hair done and I was wearing glasses and I was like, why did I do this? Why did I wear my contacts today? Because I couldn't see anything uh, that she was doing. Uh oh, oh do you like Gotta take this? them off. <laughs> <laughs> it's a surprise. Like, I just like, had to hope for the best. Like, I could like I could not see. <laughs> it was so Oh man. It was, it was fine, but never mm. again. <laughs> okay. Um I could like go on and on about lenses and problems of lenses, but let's continue with the lineup here makeup oh okay it's almost done don't worry mm. <laughs> um, no problem. then the tube next to the dandelion puff is mm. that's concealer because everybody has those days <laughs> um mm. yeah wait a moment good up they show you my day huh? you only use concealer where is the liquid foundation you don't use liquid foundation no. Oh Her skin, she's a clean girl. Yeah, she's a clean girl without the she's eyebrows. She's a clean girl. She's got the clean just, girl. Oh my god. I don't know I don't know how to use it, oh so I just god. get clear. Plus I just really need like concealer, I guess. Oh my god. That's amazing. I mean if you Fair cover blast. enough of like stuff 
uh, then you don't need it. Yeah, then don't think anybody you needs then foundation. Then you might as well use foundation. Mm. <laughs> no, because you don't need foundation. Like, uh, you don't need it everywhere, I don't think. Well, what I've no? noticed when I try to be like, okay, today I'm not going to do full makeup. I'm just going to do concealer on the spots that don't look good. Then I start out and I notice that if I don't put on the foundation, then there will be an obvious difference of where I put on makeup and where I didn't. Mm. So that's why. Or is it all in your head? No, 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 it's visible. No, it's I visible. Mean, it's, is it the right color? Is it the right color match for you? Yeah, but then uh, again, you know, I have like a million colors on my face, I feel like. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I feel like some people have mm. just more redness mm -hmm. in their face. So that's why it can show a, a very lot red face for some people. Mm, oh. me too. You can use uh have you guys tried using like the color correcting? Like greens cancel, red yes, yeah, purple it cancel, work. yellow. Yeah, I'll really. try it, yeah. It didn't it doesn't work for me. Mm. I did try. Sometimes it mm. makes it I I guess that's maybe like a product issue, like bad products, good products, but for me it made mm. it stand out a bit more, whatever I wanted to cover back in the day. But <gasps> Yeah. Have you heard of the new technique for that? Mm -hmm. The new trend is people are covering their entire face in like white, white uh, makeup paint, and then they're doing their everyday makeup routines because it's essentially starting on a completely blank canvas. <gasps> and then apparently it works on every white. skin tone, they say. What yeah. Is the product? That is insane. It, it looks crazy, but then you think about it, it's like, oh, I think, okay. I think I I've guess. seen that in like Asian makeup videos mm -hmm. there's actually this one like this one trend i guess that Aww. i've seen and they always use that so their face always is like white in the beginning but then it looks natural by the end not natural but it, it looks like like <laughs> have their you, skin by the end have you guys seen those makeup videos uh mostly like they come from uh like a asia where they pull uh -huh. out shit out of their nose yeah that's, 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 <laughs> that's, that's what i'm talking about it's the same video they be like oh those mm. are crazy man they shape their nose and yeah. they, they also put tape around their face to change their face shape. Mm -hmm. It's crazy. Mm. That's it's crazy. crazy. Watching those is very interesting because like, bam, what you can do with makeup is, is incredible. That's like, mm -hmm. like makeup artist level stuff, right? The skills. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Completely different person. Yeah. I think they use the product you're talking about though. I feel like that's the first thing they do. The, the white huh? paint? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh. Or they just use very, very bright makeup. Because, like, mm. very, very They do very that first skin. and then they put a different foundation on. Mm. Ah! I don't know. Well, that might have also just been, like, you know, the steps from a BB cream and then foundation. Mm. <gasps> a BB cream. Mm. BB cream. CC cream. Yeah, yeah. So many different ones, right? <laughs> it's crazy. Oh. Those you didn't always. That wasn't always a thing. Mm. I can't ask now. my question anymore. My it, question was gonna be, do you put concealer <laughs> on first or foundation on first? But you don't use foundation. No. <sighs> concealer. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, it uh, makes sense. Because if I, if I try to think back... You know, here we have studio light in OBS and all that. So you can't see it clearly. Uh -huh. But I think Gura had very like, you know... The pigments of her skin, they seemed all like very, like, you know... It, how, how to describe... Are very you complimenting even. my complexion? Even. Yeah! Oh yeah, so, yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's like yeah. even, even, even colors on your mm. face. <laughs> mm. Why, thank you. Mm. Like, no blotches? Is that... I don't know. Mm, yeah, I didn't notice blotches or redness. I mean, maybe there's a little bit of redness, but like not probably. Not me with my like root of the red nose reindeer nose, ma'am. Mm. <laughs> That's nonsense. I've seen you without makeup. Yeah, you know, you I, 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 I used nose. to. What are you talking I about? I used to always feel like so, like I could not, never in front of my friends or or colleagues or so i could never show myself about makeup but recently maybe because i lost all the fucks uh that i had <laughs> or other reasons but i felt uh, very, mm. pretty comfortable around you girls so that's good yeah so i, hope, I wasn't I hope wearing makeup comfy. much mm. plus when we got together we were gonna do a bunch of stuff anyway and makeup would just i don't know wouldn't that make your skin feel like it couldn't breathe 
Mmm. Ah. Like a stuff on your face. Ah. You're like, ah. I'm gonna dance, dance, but now I got thing. stuff on my... Yeah! Mm. No, not too bad, but I'm just too lazy to do my makeup these days. <laughs> I, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And your blush, is your blush good? I Actually, I don't use ah. blush. I'm surprised you use what? blush. I don't use blush all the time, but mm. sometimes I also use it on my eyes, because I'm lazy and I don't know mm. really... Uh, so, like, ah. you can, like... Take a big blush brush and you just like dot the outer corners of your eyes, your cheek over your nose, on the tip if you want, the body, chin. But yeah, it's a really pretty pale pink. Mm. It's cute. I'm cute. Oh, Nars. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nars. What is this? And then that is Cat's Wing by Tony Moly Clear Compact. <gasps> that stuff is really good. I really like that stuff. What um, is it? You use it's... compact powder without a foundation? Yeah! Interesting. What's compact powder? Um, what I mean, it just... It, what this does is, like, pores. Like, your pore sizes. It blurs pores. Uh, and it just kind of oh. evens out. If I have any redness, I'll just, like, dust it lightly. I don't want to pack it. I've seen people pack it in, and that... Mm. It can look, like, flaky and chunky if you do that. Mm. So it's just really lightly if you want uh, mm. to blur pores. To blur... You can blur pores? Yeah! yeah. I thought you just use filters. <laughs> wait, wait. Well, Blur. What is this? What's it called? Cat uh, wink. Cat wink. Compact Cat powder. powder. Well, it's basically, it's one. it's just like powder. You know, I uh, I use it too. I feel like you can't finish your makeup. I feel like we had this talk last time. Maybe maybe it was with Fauna or someone. No 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 no. I remember this. Yes, oh, uh, <laughs> you, were, you were surprised that I didn't was it put, you? like, a finishing powder But that's or why you didn't know what this is either. <laughs> mm, I actually have some now. I do oh. have some. But I don't... <laughs> I think the last time I wore makeup was when I was in Japan. <laughs> ah! So now you yeah. thought after that last Girls Talk episode, oh, I gotta get myself some powder? <laughs> yeah! Because oh. it... it it makes your makeup stay longer, right? Exactly! Yeah. yeah! Have you tested it out? Have you seen a difference? No, I got sick, so I didn't wear makeup. You haven't tested it? Okay, but when you test no. it, I think you will notice a difference. Because then you can also... You don't have to be so careful when touching your face and all that. It will stay pretty well. Oh. Mm. But, Guna, do you apply it with a brush or a puffy thingy? Or... Um, it really whatever I have on hand. Mm. Sometimes, because it comes with a sponge, mm -hmm. but the sponge can be kind of too intense. So yeah, oh, yeah. I have like a fluffy brushy, then I'll do that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, I fluffy guess you're brush. setting the the concealer at least with that. Yeah, that makes yeah, sense. yeah, yeah, under the eyes Whoa. and stuff. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Next time I meet you, I gotta look closer at your face, Gura. Oh, please don't. <laughs> <laughs> please. <laughs> I didn't oh. really wear... I don't really wear... I mean, I don't really... I don't wear much. Yeah. Well, you know what? You know what? If we if we meet again, let's do like a, a one one day when if we go to dinner or so. Let's be yeah. like, okay, tonight we, we're gonna be pretty for ourselves. So we make ourselves pretty. Please help me. I think that's probably <laughs> why I also don't wear much makeup because I'm scared I'm, it's gonna look bad and I'm I'm not gonna know. Mm. It looks bad. And I'm like that with hair too. I'm really bad with hairstyles. Oh, but hair. Mm. I feel like no. hair you know right away because it's it's no. your. No. No. I'm bad. Mm. I'm really, really, really bad at hair. I mm. struggle to put my ponytail up. <laughs> A ponytail. What ponytail height do you like? I won't play with your hair. I'll help. <laughs> I I used to have it really high because that's the only way I knew how to do it. But oh. when I try to do different ones, like it's either like it's too much to one side or it's bumpy. Or I don't like oh. how my hair in the front looks. I just don't know what to do. I don't know how. Well, mm. Yeah, I can't. What else? I don't know. I can't use clips. Like I bought a clip or oh. no, they... Like, they had to put the clip in my hair because I was like, I don't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's cute how lost you are, but. Damn. <laughs> Why? Well, I feel like a ponytail. Damn, that you. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> I know. Well, I can do it. It just looks bad. Like, there's bumps. I don't know how to. Say. Like, do I just have a bumpy head? What's wrong with me? You don't have <laughs> ah, I think. Cute. I think what you maybe. Maybe the, the step that you're missing is like. You 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 take your hair right and you kind of hold it mm. up right 
And then, mm -hmm. and then if you just put put all the hair together with your hand, yes, it will come mm -hmm. out bumpy in some spots. You have to uh, have your brush in the other hand and hold yeah. the hair in the other hand. And with the brush, carefully, mm -hmm. you brush everything towards where you're holding the the ponytail. And then, before it all gets loose again, then you tie it up. Get it? I try that. <laughs> I, I try. <laughs> Usually that helps, but yeah. then I, I don't know. There's always something wrong with it. <laughs> okay, Mame. You too. Next time we meet, I, uh -huh. I, will, I will observe. Uh, we will observe and we will check oh, what's God. wrong. <laughs> we'll I fix think... it. <laughs> I think there's like a what ponytail looks best for your face shape kind of oh, thing. Yeah. Uh, well, like one trick that maybe maybe you could try it if you want that I've learned works really well with me is that I follow when I want to do a ponytail, you look at your chin and then your mm. ear, and you follow that line, oh. and that's the general height of the ponytail that. Uh, I've heard of that. It, it really works when I try it because I used to have the same problem. Like I don't know, I don't know how to do a ponytail. But when I started following the my yeah chin ear line, mm. I was like, oh, that kind of works better. <laughs> I guess something yeah. I don't something I don't get is like for low ponytails. Like your hair kind of stays parted at the top, right? Because it's low. Oh, what? Well, that was weird. My own what? one. What? Do you have, if you have pieces that like frame the face, I feel like that mm -hmm. helps if it looks weird. Yes, like yes. little bangs and mm -hmm. side bangs and, and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, when I do a ponytail, I also mm -hmm. I leave out like some front uh, framing mm -hmm. hair pieces. Yeah. yeah. Like oh, animal God. girls. I also really like mm -hmm. pineapple hairstyle. Do you guys do that? Pineapple? You mean a really, 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 really high ponytail? Uh, no. Uh, what I... You take a clippy, and mm. then you take your hair, and you twist it, and then you pull it up, ah! and you pinch it, and then the top parts of your hair kind of spread oh, yeah, out you like do that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> pineapple. ponytail. Yeah, I never pineapple. do that, but I wanna do... I wanna do that. But I don't know oh, if it looks that. good on me. Mm. I'm sure it will. It feels... To me, it feels like such a at-home doing uh, my skincare routine kind of hair thingy. Like just to it's cute. throw it back because it's easy to do, right? Yeah. Mm. But for me, it feels like a, like a home thing. But some girls can make it work outside. I just don't understand how. <laughs> how, how it can look like something I could wear outside and not like too private, intimate. The intimate? <laughs> I don't know, like, like bathrobe kind of <laughs> hairstyle. Bathrobe. So. Wouldn't that be mm -hmm. the, that'd be like the messy bun, like the I just woke up bun. That's mm. what I I I don't wear the the I don't ever wear a bun out. I don't know. I feel like do the pineapple bun. hair, is, but buns buns I don't have do to be a pretty. Bun well either. But you say that, and I would love to do a messy hair bun, but my messy hair buns never look like the cute messy hair buns from the cute girls. <laughs> Mine always never. is like oh oh dear, yeah. I think when you don't care about what it looks like. And you just do it, you know, blah, blah, blah. then uh. then you're one of the cute, cool girls who can do a good, messy ha uh, hair bun without caring. And that works. It just works. You just you just don't have to care. Lucky. <laughs> That's why the pineapple works. Because mm. pineapple. Because it looks, it looks good. <laughs> are, you, are you looking up all the hairstyles? <laughs> this, this one is showing you what not to do and what to do. Uh -huh. but I don't know how to do it. I, I only know how to do the, the one on the left. Oh, which oh, looks yeah. stupid. <laughs> but don't do yeah. it. That's like, I yeah. get it. <laughs> it looks stupid on me. So much effort goes into the one on the right. That's the yeah. other thing. Girls, they, they, it looks much. like, oh, it's effortless, but no, it's not. I don't get it. Mm. <laughs> It's okay, Mume. Buns, I also have issues with. I feel like it's not mm. as easy as the, as girls like to make it out to be. No. Mm. Mm. <laughs> it's not that easy. No, no, no. No, no. As long as you're comfortable. <laughs> uh, I want to do here. Well, we're done with the skin and the makeup. Thank you for sharing. Uh, I think I can indeed confirm you are a girl. <laughs> Congratulations! Yay. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. Okay. Guda actually brought some topics that she wanted to yeah. discuss. 
So... If you wanna... Please... Um, I, I, I give you this fashion trends. Fashion trends? What exactly did you want to discuss about recent oh, fashion yeah. trends? We discussed oh, yeah. already a little bit in our Discord group, and I am what? already confused. <laughs> Is it some research? <laughs> yeah, recent fashion trends that are why, why, what, that you like, that you don't like, or that generally confuse you, like the. The one we talked about. Mm. La 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 versus okay, 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 girls. <laughs> what the heck is that? Guys, <laughs> do you know what that is? La la la, a girl or boy, and okay, 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 girl or boy? Any idea? Yes. <laughs> if you Google it, you will not be able to tell the difference. <laughs> I I will actually, so... I don't give a shit, so I'm showing one of the pictures. Don't worry, no, no faces. The, the last one I'm gonna show mm. on our screen. Mm. Yeah, this is from... Uh... Are you an okay, 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 okay? Or a la 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 la? Uh... Okay, okay let's Jack, read. Okay, okay, you? okay. A <laughs> uh, girl likes to apparently keep to herself, is more a tomboy than girly, chilled, likes to be alone, introverted, quiet, good listener, uh... thinks of head, logical, <gasps> and is more mature. Well, the la 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 girl is more extroverted, girly, likes to impress, talkative, thinks with her heart, <laughs> acts before thinking, less mature, off with the fairies, and is flirty. What, <laughs> what does that mean, off with the fairies? Uh, off with the fa Oh, she's like, um. Like, she's like, oh, I'm going into the forest and be a fairy. Wee. That's her oh, thing? Oh, she's going off with the fairies. I'm, ah. going, I'm going to go to the forest and oh, spin around in a dress. Oh. And be like, ah. <laughs> what <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> Honestly, this seems like the, the the girls that came up with this, I feel like are mostly la 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 girls. Uh, also uh, under the age of 15, it feels. If you go to yeah. the comments... Yeah. <laughs> no, I, if you go to the comment sections, like, because I did research on TikTok, mm. it's just, uh. I'm both. I'm totally both. Hey, that's well, so me, but so I'm real. Both. <laughs> I mean, I'm not, I'm not one of these. I can't say I'm one of these either. I'm okay, like, okay, like, okay. <laughs> it's like maybe you're both because these are very common traits and people yeah. can like yeah. flip flop. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Very general. You could be okay, okay one day and la 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 the next day. Yeah. But I love the the boy one. Okay, okay, okay. The first thing is gamer. gamer. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, what are these ones? Gamer, the funny one, dad of the group, good what advice giver, reasonable, easygoing, loyal, has many friends but a small inner circle. Okay, cares for his family. So and la 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 boys are dreamy, make stupid jokes, is the friend that gets bullied, oh, loved by what? many, popular. Eh? A friend that gets bullied but is also popular? Hmm. Sporty, 388 needs the advice. What does that mean? Nice what is that? What's no. That mean? <laughs> no. <laughs> Free eight eight? Free eight eight? Is that like what a... Is this? What is that? Kid three. humor. What is this? What is three three, three eight eight needs the fine TikTok. Oh wait, oh wait, no, 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 no. That's just the bookmark number. <laughs> See, I don't use TikTok. I don't I don't fucking know. <laughs> Word that only guys know, or so who knows. I thought it was uh, like slang for something. Yeah, like <laughs> code. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Never mind. That scratch that. So they just they're mm -hmm. the ones that need the advice. They don't give it. Okay. <sighs> okay. So yeah. Well. So of course, probably most people code are both. Dear. Oh, you should have seen the comments for this one. Mm -hmm. It was like uh, I need. Oh, actually, no. The caption. Or something. <laughs> what does the caption say? Hold on, I'll read it. Oh. It was like... The comments, they're all like, I need a... A okay, okay... <gasps> yeah, I'm a 100% a la la girl. Oh. And the, I need an okay, okay, okay boy. So this is like... <laughs> I think it's just... The current trend with... Mm -hmm. Yeah. 15 year olds. Uh... It seems. It's like the astronomy people, like the I'm a I'm a Capricorn rising sun. That's exactly what I what I started thinking. Yeah, I'm mm, like it's no like offense astronomy. if you are one of those, but mm. one of those if you like astronomy like that, but I don't know, it's kind of crazy. 
Is it no astrology? Astron astronomy? Astronomy? Uh, astronomy? That's astronomy. Uh, uh, astronomy uh, like, goes, <laughs> it's interesting what some of it or some people go like maybe a little bit too deep into it. Or rely a little bit too much on it. But then uh -huh. the other day I was watching like a YouTube video and this girl like looks at someone uh, uh several people and first try guesses their zodiac thingy just because of their first vibe that they give off and the first word and they say. No, but yes. it actually that had happened. And I was like, well, wow. I mean, I don't believe in this stuff, but good job, girl. <laughs> was, it, was it a YouTube video? It, yes. Scripted? Edited? No, no not scripted. Adjusted to no, fit? No, why don't you believe? <laughs> Goya, you're not a believer. <laughs> I don't believe either, but that was cool. Like, I mean, you know. <laughs> Oh shit, I'm being Gosh. judged. <laughs> I wonder how some people would be like, I can't be your friend because you're a la 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 girl and I just don't vibe with that. <laughs> nah, I'm sorry. Nah. <laughs> I don't think so, but I feel like generally the image. I feel like that what I said that I think uh, La 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 girls came up with that. I feel like this is like a little bit like low key, very low key, hidden message, a little bit roasting. Okay, 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 girls. Don't you think? <laughs> Like, tomboy. Like, I don't know. I mean, um, some of these feel like they're trying to make the Lala girls look better. Here, do you want me to show you <laughs> pictures? Like, can I show you other things I found that. Yeah. The like, pictures are, that you sent or, so I'll far show you a video. We're like, oh my god, girls. La la la. Oh Those are like, okay, okay, okay. Those okay. are Instagram video. girls. <laughs> Ja, ja, ja. I, I probably can't show it on the stream, but you sure? No, you can't, but... Bring it on. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> no, 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 no. are cute, but I'm still, like, saying... It feels like the Lala -la girls are dumping, dunking on the... Okay, Make okay, sure okay, okay. dumping and dunking. Mm. Make sure okay. desktop audio is off. Okay, 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 girls. Um, okay, kind of... Okay, okay. Here's a screenshot, too. Oh, oh pictures! What is oh, this? Wait, oh, 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 shit, I forgot that. <laughs> I forgot music was a thing when I play this. <clears throat> Mute. Okay, okay, okay. What the la, fuck is la, going la, on? I don't get it. Uh, the la, la, la girl is like the hyperactive one. And okay, okay, I was reading a book and it's chilling. Mm. Mm. I see. What? What? This is like before and after an iced coffee. This could be the same <laughs> person. Or oh, Red that's Bull. Why, yeah. The, that's why the comments say, um, hold on. The comments say, I can do both. My two personalities. It's me. <laughs> ah. Like for real. Like me for real. <laughs> that's really the next one. <laughs> hey, I'm adding weird TikTok fashion trends because we're talking more about like. Also, yeah. thank you, Mume, for being our. TikTok yeah. Intel are a secret spy. No problem. Google Google couldn't help me with that one, so I I uh, went to TikTok. I am not Should gonna go sacrifice no. my sanity uh, <laughs> to add another social media to my social media list and go on TikTok. No, uh -uh, don't uh -uh. don't don't use TikTok. It's mm. stupid. It's a waste. Of, <laughs> it's a waste of everything. Something <laughs> something some I I saw this like said or written somewhere just like yesterday or so. That like the YouTube Shorts, like so many TikToks get uploaded, re-uploaded on YouTube Shorts, and honestly, like YouTube Shorts are like a filtered version of TikTok. Like you get some of the good stuff, you get way less shit than if you were scrolling through TikTok. You know what I mean? I think so, but here's the thing: I used to. <laughs> so wait, I have uh -oh. a question. Do you, mm -hmm. do you guys use Instagram? Like do you yeah. mm -hmm. look through Instagram? Because Instagram also kind of has something like. Reels, uh, you mean? TikTok. No, Reels. no, no. Um, no, I think yeah. TikTok, uh, stories. Or, you mean Instagram stories? Just no. Hmm? I think Instagram has something that's like. Oh no, Those maybe not. Those no, are Reels. Instagram Reels. Yeah, are like, mm -hmm. like yeah, TikTok, for you. I think. Old. Anyways, my point is that there are people that will be like TikTok sucks. You shouldn't go on TikTok, but then they'll go on like Instagram or Facebook <gasps> or <laughs> Twitter oh, and find find <laughs> a like something that's from TikTok that's uploaded there. But the TikTok is like three months old. So if someone tries to yeah. send me a meme, yeah, you send me a meme and you're like, look at this. But I've seen it on TikTok three months ago. Yeah, I, I will straight up get, tell you. <laughs> you get all the stuff earlier if you're on TikTok. That is true. 
<laughs> That's what I found out about croissant <laughs> so late. Croissant, croissant, croissant. <laughs> but yeah, but no, say... TikTok, TikTok's worse. It's just you say... it's, it is a bunch of garbage. Ew, TikTok, stinky, smelly. And you spend, you send something funny like, look at this but, by the way, I found yeah, it. Yeah, but sometimes it's, <laughs> you sometimes do find a good meme or something funny, and you just really wish the algorithm. Mm. Keep showing you the funny memes, the things you like, but it doesn't. Mm. Sometimes you get a real juicy algorithm, though. Mm -hmm. After like three refreshes, you're like, oh, oh. finally. Oh, I enough. found TikTok black. experience after all. No, no, Instagram. Oh, right? Instagram. Okay, TikTok. okay. I mean, Insta the reels. <laughs> yeah. Instagram reels, the, the algorithm. You gotta refresh a few times, but then sometimes mm. you find the funny ones. You're like, oh, thank God. Yeah, I think Instagram algorithm is pretty good because, like, I I try to stay away from that like suge suggestion page. But oh my god, mm -hmm. it shows me like the prettiest like hairdresser hair salon pictures. And every time I look, I'm like, oh, I want to do this hair color. I want to do this hair. Color. Oh my god, this hair style. Oh my god, oh, blah, 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 blah. Uh, like the al algorithm is pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Yeah. Was there any other weird? TikTok fashion trends? Oh. Says this new... Okay, 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 la la la. I forgot. I didn't do my research. <laughs> um, I think that was the one that stood out to me the most. Yeah. That was just... Whoa, um, what? Something I have heard about it before. It hmm. seems like Y2K fashion is kind of coming back. I love Y2K. I mean, maybe that's... Maybe, maybe New Jeans has an influence in that. I love Y2K. Mm -hmm. New Jeans K-pop group, super popular right now. Rising stars. And they do, their the whole theme of the group is like Y2K. Yeah. Like, uh, and they, their songs and their fashion and everything. Yeah, they're so cute. Ah! Mm -hmm. um, yeah, anyway. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, they're the ones that are like... Hmm? Do, do, Cookie. Do, 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 do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I no. want to... Yeah, that's diddle. Da, 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 diddle. In, in the middle. Like you a little. Da, 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 da. And they did, oh my, oh my god. Da, ba, da, ba, da, ba, da, da, da. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because... Uh -huh. uh, yeah, you're my high boy. That one too. Sing cookie. Cookie's good. Da, 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 cookie. Yeah. <laughs> what? I don't know this one. Right off. <laughs> oh, I didn't know when to stop. <laughs> But you know, you know something that makes me not sad. Mm -hmm. I don't know what it makes me feel. But mm -hmm. when I, you know, was in school, in middle school, mm -hmm. there was like certain types of fashion and I did not like it. Like I wasn't comfortable with it. I just oh. wanted to wear baggy clothes. Oh. But I think like then that. like tight stuff, like tights and shorts and stuff. Were what, what, were what was popular, but I just wanted to wear baggy pants and baggy shirts. But now, huh. that's what's popular in schools, apparently. Oh. Yeah, like big baggy cargo like oversized pants. stuff. Yeah, big yeah. Hoodies. yeah, the cargo pants. Yes. <laughs> and I'm like, that. man. I think <laughs> I kind of get it. I mean, I feel like the things in Austria were different probably than what you experienced, mm. but... Yeah, that's a good point too. Like like mm. things that, that I would wear. Mm, nah, nah, probably I would still get weird looks partially today, but maybe they they would be more accepting a little bit. Mm. Even in America, I think it's probably like different fashion mm. trends and stuff. Like I could mm. show you guys later what people at my school wore, mm. but I don't think it's what people I don't know in like other places. Like I don't know. <gasps> I remember. Uggs? It yeah. was Uggs, leggings. Or yes, was, the leggings. Pink, pink leggings, right? Victoria's Secret pink with the fold over tops. <gasps> pink! The pink Victoria's and, Secret pink! <laughs> yes! And then some girls would wear the, uh, you'd either wear North Face on top. North Face! Uh, or you would wear, like, lots of layers or, like, Hollister or Abercrombie or something like that. Oh my. There is Goodness. one fashion trend uh, that I feel like in the past five to eight years has become like a big, big thing that I cannot get behind. 
And oh, I know what? it's so popular that this... Uh, maybe within our circle right now, uh, it, I will get a good reaction, but overall, maybe not. It's... um, I can't get behind wearing leggings as pants. <gasps> Just leggings. Oh. You can't always what was see the whole before. butt and the <laughs> outline of your panties and I, I don't know. Every outline... He it, no, 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 I'm sorry, no, you no. You see, this is why I loved oversized things. So, I was gonna say, yes, <laughs> because like jeggings and leggings, that's what people wore. Mm. So I would wear an oversized sweatshirt like every day. I was every saying, single okay day. If you wear like a hoodie that covers all of the Yeah, it covers it. Stuff, but, mm. but I was like one of the like people usually wouldn't cover it. Yeah, no, people yeah. like... Oh, did you have, have some girls, they would, they would like wear a like string underwear and they would make sure you could see it. They would pull the string up above <laughs> the what? legging line. Yeah, like the waist line. Yeah, yeah, we had yeah. a dress code. We couldn't do <laughs> that. You know, once I got dress coded because there was a small rip in my jeans above <gasps> my knee. You got dress coded? What? That? About just a little rip. You could see my skin Oof. above my knee. Oof. But, you know what's stupid? What? Uh -huh. Is that you could wear shorts that were shorter than where the rip was. <laughs> That's well, stupid. yeah, you have to be dressed prop, I guess. I don't it's know. Like you, it's you look like a, <laughs> your clothes look, look broken and they don't Maybe. understand it's a, it's a fashion thing. <laughs> they shouldn't... I don't know. I was really but, annoyed. I was like, well... Ah! But you know about <laughs> leggings? Just the other day, I was like... I went hiking and... I um, I was gonna wear something, you know, for hiking, okay? And I think mm -hmm. when you do sports, then okay, leggings... Even though I, I still feel embarrassed about them, I, I would say they fit into the category if you wear them for sports. But, so, I wanted to wear something fitting for hiking and... My... I have a, like a pair of leggings that is connected with shorts and that... That Ooh. wasn't, that wasn't uh -huh. clean, so I couldn't wear that. So, but then uh -huh. I had another pair of leggings... That I was like, okay, I guess I'll wear this for the first time in my life now. And I put it on, and I see like, eh, it's so embarrassing. <laughs> so I tried to find clothes that are longer than my butt um, to combine it with. I uh, tried so hard, and then you know, I ended up wearing like a pretty long jacket because eh, <laughs> it's embarrassing. I think you need to you need to find a good pair of leggings for like. Working you mean a out really, because a really thick pair. You mean? I don't know. I have a pair that's like, I, I, I what, what is it? Like they're running oh. leggings or something. So like they're very breathable, mm. but you can't see anything. Like you don't. But yeah. I've had leggings where you can, but oh, they were cheaper. Geez. I think. So I, you have to put them. in. I think an extra buck. Mm. Well, those that I had, they the were pretty are. proper though. Mm. They were but pretty I proper. Were, I still wear long, like long stuff over it. Yeah, and you can wear like, shorts on top if you want. I, that's that's okay. Mm. Oh, look, you know, um, actually, just the, just the other day, I watched a YouTube video where, um, oh. you know, this 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 person is interviewing people on the street in Japan, and they're like, "Hey, you know about this fashion trend overseas, like in America and so on, that everybody likes to wear leggings, and all these Japanese people that are being interviewed, mostly girls, they're all like, yeah, yeah, I mean, I see it.'" Sometimes on tourists in in Japan, um, mm. but like I could never do this. Like every single Japanese girl is like, I could never do this. Leggings, wearing it underneath something, yes. But this will never be popular in Japan because mm. no, we don't want to. Like you see everything, right? If it, they they even said that oh, when they see tourists who wear that on the street in Tokyo and so on, they don't mind, you know, they, they look good in it, but for them, mm. they would never, they couldn't. It's like a cultural thing. They feel too hazukashi about it in Japan. It is hazukashi. Mm. Oh, Japan doesn't, they don't like showing, uh, like, chest either, right? Like, cover your, like, yeah. the shoulder and the shoulder chest as line well. as well. Yeah. I don't know how they do it, though, because in summer it gets so hot, like, Damn! How can you still cover up your shoulders? It's so hot. Ugh. <laughs> you know, mm. like with the legging thing, I 
You ever see people that are like skin colored? Like, yeah. Oh my god, yes. That's like <laughs> the next step. Why? I don't get it. That's I right. Saw a lady going into Walmart and she had flesh tone leggings yeah. on and I had a heart attack. They look naked. Yeah. It's scary. You're like, am I witnessing a crime oh right now? Or. <laughs> Is this public indecency, Granny? Yeah. Or are you just wearing leggings? It's getting pretty bed, close to it, it. yeah. I, I don't understand that at all. <laughs> yeah. Wait, yeah. I wanna, I wanna get your opinion on this too. Oh, this is a fashion trend that I can't get behind. I think this is starting to catch. I feel like it's rather recent, but I'm not entirely sure. I might be a little behind. <laughs> <laughs> Ballerina flats. With Wait, oh, your problem is not wearing ballerinas with socks, but just ballerinas? Just everything in general, but also ballerina floods in general. I, if, if you are not a ballerina, like if you wear them in I'll general, show I just... That one looks beautiful to normally walk around in. I don't okay. know. And that's a bummer because I like... Am I saying this right? I like Mew Mew, but I don't... The shoe, it just... I, uh, uh. I use... I mean, I think ballerinas on their own are fine. But with socks, obviously, that's like... Uh, uh, socks like that? No, no, no. <laughs> I don't think ballerinas. Eh? are it. are comfy. I mean, I don't, I don't even own a pair of ballerinas, actually. But back in the day, I used to wear them sometimes. So, you know. Oh, it's just... I thought they were actual ballerina shoes. Is there no. a type of shoe that's based no. on ballerina shoes? Um, yeah. It's just like flat um, shoes like these. They're called ballerinas. Oh. You just slip in. They scream band recital in fifth grade to me. <laughs> 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 Ballerina flats. Let me hit the flats out so we can blast on this clarinet. Like, <laughs> no! Yeah, but they, with the right clothes, they can look really cute, Gobidi Ball. No, I'll take oh. these instead. Wait, what are your thoughts on these? Oh. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Wait, why can't I have this picture? Oh, no. no, wait. No! I have, huh? I have don't, a question. Don't show me Crocs. This. And what if I was no. going to... No, no these are different. Ba these, yes. I think, oh, Yes, big yes. Yes. Oh, yeah, I've seen this. I, I have shoes like that. Mary Jane's. Pass. Call them Mary Jane's? Yeah. Oh. Ballet flats? Wait, pass? Not pass. Pass is in like pass. They the pass class. the test. They pass. They pass okay. the test. Ballerina yeah. flats get a fail from me. <laughs> yeah, I'm fucking cute. Especially, I mean, yeah. with with like underneath uh, so white socks that end under the knee, or like cute black ties or, or whatever. I yeah. don't know. Many combinations cute, cute, cute. possible. Yeah. Mm. I wear sneakers. <laughs> what kind of sneakers? Let me see if I can find them. <laughs> I love sneakers. They're really dirty and they're falling apart. If it if I step in a puddle, it'll get on my socks. Like it, it'll like go into my shoe. <gasps> be careful, you could get a foot fungus. <laughs> it's a good be thing I don't careful. walk in puddles. <laughs> be careful of the foot fungus. Mm. Um, I can't. Mm. But sneakers uh, are cute. Sneakers and Con Converse. I don't know. Like Crocs. Crocs, Crocs no. Like Crocs, yeah. I'm, I'm boring. Oh no. no, those are cute! Yeah. You I'm can boring. wear that with like almost, almost everything too. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> That's why I only need... I only need four pairs of shoes. There. Plus, if you get oh bored with them, you can like... You can like draw on them or you can like paint them. <laughs> Yeah! Oh my god! Like when I was in school, I think uh, it was it was like popular to start like on the internet at least it was popular. People were like uh, drawing on white blank Converse shoes and making like yeah. the sickest shoes ever. So cool. I think it's cool. Oh, mm. I used to draw on my Converse. Really? It's mm. perfect shoe with canvas and yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So nice. I wanted to do that too, but I never got to do it. Hmm. Um, okay. Girls, girls, girls. Yes. Uh, I have a question for you. Okay. What are those? What is this item? <laughs> I, will, I will show you certain items that apparently will be familiar to girls. But, you know, there was like a list, you know? 
And uh -oh. <laughs> most of them I understood, but some of them even I was unsure. And those are the ones I'm bringing here to ask you guys, girls, what do you think this is? And also the chat, feel free to guess what I, I am showing you. No cheating, chat. No, no Googling. cheating, yeah. Not um, a reverse image search. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. no. Um, for, before saying anything, just say if you know what it is or not. If you don't know, okay? Oh, okay. Okay. What is this? I think oh. I know, but I'm not sure. I just want to confirm with you girls. I think I know. Mm hmm. Mume? Oh, interesting. I think I know. Okay. Mume? <laughs> the chat is confused. <laughs> I All I can that. think of is like a phone case. <laughs> ah, okay, like, the dimensions mm. are maybe confusing. Yeah, yeah. Like, I, how big is it? Is this a piece of paper? Like, I think it's pretty small. It, what I sticker? think it is is probably like you're supposed to put it on your nails and then yeah. draw over it like a stencil. Ah, nail stickers. A stencil. But what the heck are the ones that are fully? <gasps> Wait, it's what? sponge. It's nail sponge. You put that down as the stencil and then you dip the the what? solid colored ones in your polish and then you roll it possibly. What? <gasps> what? Maybe. Real? Maybe not. See, I'm, 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 I'm not, not sure. sure. I, think, I think I know what you're talking about. They, I think they use that for like gradient stuff. Oh, oh. oh. yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, I oh. think that. I think, I, think I, I can get the solution. Uh, wait, 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 wait. wait Either that or makes me want Tic Tacs. So okay, I think What's I think it's something with flavor? nails. It is. Orange. It is nail vinyls, vinyls, vinyls. <laughs> Ewa? Nail, vinyls, vinyls? Vinyls? Vinyls, vinyls yeah. Ah. yeah. It's weird. I don't huh. ever see this. I mean... I guess you cut it, like, around? What? Huh. Yeah, you so. put it on your nail, and then you fold it where the end of your nail is, and then you file it off. Oh. oh that's, that's how I used to do it. <laughs> you <laughs> used like, this before? Yeah. Oh, good on nose. So many girl like things. <laughs> Nails oh. are fun. Do you guys like nails? Um, I yes, I like looking at pretty nails, but I never do them. I I don't. I want pretty nails. But <laughs> I, I, well, I, well, you had matching nails with Council. I was so yeah, jealous. We, well, we we got our nails done, but oh, did I? Okay, so when mm. I returned home, I mm. needed to get them removed, right? How did you do it? I went to a nail place. Oh. oh. It took them over two hours to remove them. <laughs> they were like, what on earth is this? What did you do? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and you know... <laughs> they said from now on, we're going to ask clients when they need to remove gel nails if they got them in Japan. Because oh. what, what what on earth? <laughs> yeah. That's cool. Because then they don't come off when you get your hands wet or you J bump... Japan's the bit it was, extra. It was the charms. It was the, ch the charms were just mm. completely stuck. They had. They were like trying to file them. Ooh. They were... <laughs> it was, it was so bad. And so though? painful. <laughs> oh, they were really? snowflakes. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because it was winter, right? You were, you, you were on theme with the season. I got my nails. So after that, I got gel nails again, and they were just a flat color. Mm. But then I got sick. So I didn't like, and I have the cough, and I don't like going places with a cough. Mm. And so I couldn't go to get them changed or removed. Oh. I was like, I need to, I, need, I want to get them off. So I got like a home kit to do it. It did not work. It just made them look awful. So I was trying to like, Oh, no. Peel them off, and then I tried another way. Mm. Did not work. Uh -oh. Tried, and then I just ended up soaking my fingers in acetone, mm. and mm. it kind of worked. But I still have a little bit left on some of my nails. It looks so bad, but I'm just waiting until it grows to the point where I can just cut it, <laughs> cut, cut it off. I see. But that was like yeah. your your kind of first uh, experience with nails. That one in Japan? Nail. Mm. Now, I've got, I've got like, manicures before and I used to try doing nail art, but it was, you know, normal nail polish that would chip after two days. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah, me too. I mean, okay, I played a, a, around a little bit with nail polish, but that's it. Gooby Do you DIY your own acrylics? <gasps> Wait, Gooby I remember your nails 
looked pretty when I saw them. They weren't like, you know, they didn't have a million things on them, but they looked yeah. pretty. I like them. Um, I like... I usually get the the lazy one. I used to... I used to... I like got like a big bag of assorted nail sizes. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, and then the you like... Uh, yeah, you like glue them on yourself, yeah. but you have to like shape them and file them down yourself. So it's you a do big, that? It's a process. I don't do it anymore, but I used to. Because then you control the, the size and the shape if oh. you want like uh, coffins or squares or whatever they're called. Almonds, and then you paint them. Mm. Uh, but yeah, I like the pop on ones. I think those were what I was wearing when I went. Uh, mm. when I was but don't you ever lose your nails with those? Yes. Mm. And yes. Then you just. That's Hold so the annoying. finger underneath. Yeah? Yes. No, no, no. <laughs> then I... it's a free. You can use that to pick your nose then. So it's good. <laughs> good and bad. <laughs> I, um... I had... I, I got those before. I don't know if they were acrylic. Mm. What they were made of. I got mm -hmm. ones where you glue them on. Mm -hmm. Right? And press. And then shape them. Mm. And I was so dumb. I did it before I needed to write an essay. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> I'm trying to type. I'm like, what have I done? This is right? horrible. It feels like so people, weird. So I'm used to live it. Like this. Yeah, yeah, that was I also my reaction. Nails. I well, like, I forgot about my essay. Started looking up videos like how do people do things with nails? How do people type with nails? And I, what? I saw like videos and they type so freaking slowly. <laughs> what? Yeah. You can't but use lash like, to kiss that goodbye. <laughs> And then I like look how they do I look how they do dishes and mm. how they I don't know, tie their shoes and stuff. Like people with really long. How nails. do you use the toilet? Oh. Yeah, how do I use the toilet? Yeah, yeah. yeah oh my, I, oh god. my god. Yeah, that, I, I I I put on fake nails like glue on once for the first time like last year once, and mm -hmm. I was so lost. I put it on and it's like it felt to me like how. A doggo feels when you put socks on him. And he's like... I can't put on the floor. But then when you look at your hands and it elongates your fingers... It looks like, pretty, yeah. so pretty. It looks pretty. But, but then issue. also, I didn't oh. have the, the thing to take off the nails. So then I mm. was like even more in trouble. Just like you, Lune. <laughs> yeah. But a big issue I had was... So... Probably after a week, I guess the glue kind of loosens up. Like, probably when you shower and wash your hair mm. and stuff. So when you mm. wash your hair, like, my hair would sometimes get stuck under a really small yes. part of the nail. It feels oh. horrible. It feels it's so horrible. bad. Eh. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> if you brush your hair, like, it, it's, your hair will get stuck. Yeah. Like, hot on the tiniest yeah. little opening. It's Ooh, the worst. Uh. Ooh, and that uh. hurts. <laughs> But then there's oh. the fear if you get water stuck underneath because you could get an infection or a fungus mm -hmm. or something really mm -hmm. bad. If, like, if you squeeze the top and you hear it going like... Because the there's fuck? water stuck yeah. under the nails, you gotta pull it off. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> and then you just end up falling off eventually, like, on their own. But sometimes, oh my yeah. gosh, it'd be so painful. Like, or they get stuck on... Like, I don't know. It, it was painful. Good on. Ah. So you now you know Council got like matching nails one yes. time in Japan. So no, I don't I feel to. worried about uh, you know getting nails, but do you wanna do it sometime to go? Yes. Hey. yes. <laughs> I knew I knew you would say yes. <laughs> I would say yes every time. <laughs> Yata Yata I don't need pretty nails, it's fine. I'm ah. pretty nails. I also I just want for that one time, just for the sake oh of doing it once, <laughs> and then I'll take him off. We all go get nails. Right Yay. now, let's go. Oh, nail salon. Nails now. Okay, let's girls, go. girls, ah, pay attention. Hand. Next item, please inspect and first say only if you know it or not. A yes. sponge. Oh, okay. <laughs> not a sponge. It. I'm get, so it, 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 it seems like a file, yeah? But like, I've seen nail files and this doesn't look like a normal nail file. I know what it is. Of course you do. It's nail related, uh, huh? Uh, uh, no, you're no? wrong. Is huh? it for the foot? For the sole of the foot? What does Mume know what it is? No, my no. Is it for the sole of the foot? It's a pumice stone. A what? Yeah. Pumice? It just looks like a stone. So is it yeah. for the foot? It is, it's for the foot <laughs> or ah, yeah. Okay, I've seen it before, yeah. That's how you make foot 
parmesan and it makes your feet all nice and smooth. Ah, I should use uh, that. <laughs> heels. I haven't used that in a long time. I kind of have the urge to chew on it though. Yeah. Huh. Do you have that <laughs> chew on stone? It looks crunchy and cold. Like it'll go. Mm. Um, but I, I, maybe... I've seen this before in the shape of a brush with like a brush handle. Those are, I think, more easy to use. Probably. Mm. Or the pet egg. Mm -hmm. Parmesan cheese collector. <laughs> mm. <laughs> <laughs> Yummy. Mumei, you wanted to it say something? Your fish. Huh? What? You wanted to say what something, Mumei? <laughs> mm -hmm. Did I? I feel like you wanted to say something. No? Okay. I feel like I did too, but I don't remember, so... Okay. <laughs> okay, okay. About... Well, that oh, one yeah. wasn't so difficult. I, I knew it was something to file something, but I thought it was for nails, I guess. It looked brutal, though. Okay. It's because of me. Yeah. <laughs> okay, next thing. This one maybe will raise more questions. For me, at least. Are they double ring fingers? <gasps> Wait, I know what it is. Punch it's someone. For rings, <laughs> rings for two... Two fingers and like they stay stuck together. I think I've seen it before, but I don't remember. Good eye. You, you always well, know. What <laughs> is it? Uh, let's move, I think. I, I don't think it's a ring thing anymore. Yeah. I, I think it's is much it smaller. Earring. It's smaller. Ah! Oh. What? Earring? It's for the back of your earring, isn't oh. it? Or like. Am I wrong? Ah, uh, I might be wrong. Is it? Um, I guess. Yeah, so are your ears the pierced? Ears. Are your ears pierced? Mine are not. I I tried They're to closed. get. Oh, <laughs> I'm wearing clip-ons right now. I tried to get <gasps> them pierced, but I couldn't. Um, like it was so hard to get them out. I couldn't get them uh, out. And I, like went to where you know what happened? I went to where I got them. Like got the piercing because like you know they give you yeah the gold you earring have to or whatever. Stay, keep in yeah for like yes. a month. Mm. Yes, and I could. It was like, over a month, and I couldn't. I, I couldn't. I was freaking out. I was like I cannot pull this. I'm not strong enough. So I went to where I got them done, and they said, uh, "Oh, we 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 can't take them out." We're not we're not really? qualified to take them out. Uh, like you have to go to a doctor if you want to take them out. <gasps> Is this like a once in a 9,000 years get together of three girls who don't uh, have ear holes? Yeah, they, well, I got them out eventually, but they closed up. I just, <laughs> they're closed now. So they're no longer pierced. Why? Me, me too. Like the same shit happened to me. For me, the oh. crazy thing was like uh, my whole like teenagehood, I never had pierced ears. Um, mm. I don't know. I, I just never got it as a child. And then the older I got, the more I was like, I don't need it, and I'm scared of it, and blah blah blah. Mm. And then and then um, uh, some time in the past three four years, three years, I actually I had like this spontaneous. Feeling that I needed them, I wanted them, I wanted to finally be a girl! So, uh -huh. I went to Claire's, because Claire's was... You know, <laughs> oh, I, I, yeah, yeah, that's like the quickest place where you can spontaneously do it and then not feel... I, I mean, I felt like a little girl when I went in. I was like, yeah. isn't this normally where little girls do it? And she was oh. like, yeah, but you know, sometimes we have adults too, you know? <laughs> um, yeah, they... <laughs> Instant. Like, you don't have to yeah. wait. No appointment. Exactly. It's such a cute store. Too. Yeah, it's cute. They have some cute things, you know. They always have, like, something where you can, like, buy free, get one free, or so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, so I did it, right? Finally. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, I did it. And she gives me this uh, ring, uh, earring that I have to keep in for a month, she says. And I thought, mm. okay, you know what? I don't I don't feel like I necessarily need to take it out right away after a month. So I kept it in for, like, three months or so. <laughs> Uh, uh, and then uh, then came a day where I went to the dentist and they had uh, me take it off for like a scan thingy and I was like no problem mm -hmm. and then okay I had some problems taking it out it was a little bit difficult but I got it out okay that's not the problem I got it out and I took the the thing the appointment and then later like a week later or so I I checked to put the earring or whatever back in again and it's already closed. Did you push yeah. it through? Of course, it was like it was through. Of course, fully through. It was it was a hole, and I kept it longer 
in even longer than recommended and I take it out for one week and it's closed again. And since then, no, I didn't like... do it again because I'm like, oh. fuck this. I'm not going to do this all the time. I'm not this all the time. I, I sometimes think... force it through after it closes because sometimes yeah, it's not skin, really? it's just like build up, like it's stuck inside. No, it felt it feels, really like, closed. Yeah, that's how I yeah. felt too. Because <laughs> but, well, after I eventually <laughs> got them out. Um, but I realized I probably could get an earring in there, but I don't think I had the right type of earring for like newly pierced ears. Mm. Because the ones that they give you, like they break after mm. you take them out. You they can break put them back in. The ones oh I got would break after, like you're not supposed to oh. put it back. You're supposed oh. to use different earrings. Mm. But yeah, I also just mm, one of my ears are kind of weird. Yeah. <laughs> it's like I don't think I want to. But I think I I told Fauna about it, and she said mm. that you should really keep them in for longer, and like you oh. basically need to wear earrings for six months. Is, yeah, I yeah. think what she said. Okay. Yeah, I'm if you I'm really, really don't want them to close that, clean and clean them. Well, yeah, I cleaned them too. I cleaned them too. I had and this cleaning lotion out. or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The it's disinfectant. Like, move it back and forth in your ear. Like, mm -hmm. it's been, it's been, it's been, yeah. I did yeah. That. Well, Ekura, why do you Ooh. not really have. Do you not have holes right now in your ears? Or do you no, just not I wear? Tried. I tried it, but, um. I get sorry, I get barfy thinking about it, cause <laughs> oh, uh, because I had the I had issues. I they had them. Uh, uh, sorry, I had them, oh. <laughs> and then also around the same time, I was like, okay, it's time to take them out. Huh. Um, I kept I fainted. I couldn't. I couldn't like wow. To, uh, uh, and then there's just no more, no more. Done, 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 done. Can't do mm. it. Oh You're my just god. Not okay. About it. It's getting me all like. <laughs> You girls have That's... no idea how like crazy this is to me. I I I I rarely ever meet a girl who doesn't have, or woman who doesn't have Ugh. ear holes. And then now mm. there's like two next to me. Ugh. What the well, fuck? The reason the reason I got them was because I had a family member who kept buying me earrings over ah. the years. I was like, and I told like multiple times told her my ears aren't pierced, but it's like ah. she assumed. <laughs> and like, eventually, I get them pierced. So uh, like, like, okay, fine, fine. But like, yeah. clip -ons. That's the thing. Like, I at, at some point I was like, what the what the hell? I don't need holes because, especially in Japan, there is a huge selection of pretty nice, elegant, <gasps> uh, clip ons. I feel oh. like in Austria, if I would look here, clip ons are only in the children's section and like the most. <gasps> Children uh, like yeah. things, but in Japan, even for like adults, there's a huge selection, and uh, and I think that's because like a lot of Japanese girls also don't pierce their ears. And earrings mm. are so pretty. Yeah, they add so much to your face. They do. The clip-ons yeah. that I am familiar with, I always assume they're like kind of big and bulky. Like you can't mm. can you get dangly earrings that are clip-ons. No, yes, there's not only too. bulky ones. There's like, yeah, simple oh, ones too. Yes. Yeah, you're I right. Just noticed, wait, why did I, I get my ear? Oh, right, because I right? got ear. <laughs> but you can change the oh. you can change the, the thing. You can change it from an earring if you want to. If you if you're a bit of crafty and you feel like oh, I want to wear this, I but I myself. can't. Yeah, you can change it. <gasps> but I do I think see. like clips hurt a little bit. But you yeah, just, that's yeah. I remember I wore my grandma's once mm. and. I felt like such an adult. <laughs> but then when I took them off, I realized how... <laughs> they were really bad for my ear. Um, it is pain. Mm, <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, there, there are magnetic ones. I guess they probably would hurt less. Magnetic uh, earrings. I don't know if I trust it. I feel like I'll fall. <gasps> Have you seen the magnetic eyelashes? I'm sorry, that's my Yes! Me. Magnetic yeah. eyelashes? Mm -hmm. yes. They make magnetic eyelashes that yeah. literally go to the top and bottom of your... Imagine like a, a lash glue, Mumei. And now this lash glue has like something magnetic in it. So you put it around like an eyeliner. You put it around your eyeline. And then you just stick on the lashes and they will just chill on there. It's really, really cool. But I've never tried it. <laughs> but it is a thing. Huh. Ooh. It's magnetic. I haven't heard of this. Look it's how cool. derpy this, this girl looks. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, they they do sometimes look a bit derpy. No, no, no it's just because of 
because the because she did a before and after. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, of course. <laughs> but sometimes I, I I do think they look a little, a little bit derpy sometimes, but generally it was pretty cool. Oh. No, I'm sure this looks good. It's just like when you put two, like you take a picture of your face and then a picture afterwards, and you don't level it up very well. Like your eyes are kind of looking to one side. That's I think I this is the same picture, Mume, but it's just uh, like one line drawn through it with like Photoshop or so. <gasps> it's a lie. It's a fake before Wait, really? and after. No, it's oh, not feel... fake. They just did, didn't do it on one oh. eye and took a picture oh. like that. Oh, I feel, I feel bad. It, yeah, well, some people just... have very. Um, this isn't this. This lady doesn't even have that uneven eyes, but some people no. have really crazy uneven faces. I've noticed like. We all get derpy recently. sometimes. I noticed that uh, Prue, Prue from Charmed, <laughs> the actress from Prue from Charmed, she has a very uneven face. <gasps> yeah. Asymmetrical. Asymmetrical. Can yes. Yeah, yeah. Can you guys do weird things with your eyeballs, like your iris? Like, can you like look in different directions or? No, no, no. Ooh, I can kind of like have one eye mm. looking forward, and then the mm. other eye cross-eyed. Oh, Ooh. how do you do that? <laughs> you look. You just do it. <laughs> I'm crying right now. <laughs> or do you ever do you ever like do your eyes in the mirror and like you can kind of see your other eye and it, you can see it looking at, like where your eye is in the it just looks really do you, do you know what I'm talking about? I, if you go to go to a mirror and focus on one eye and uh -huh. then don't look at your other eye but just like kind of acknowledge it, you'll see it looking. <laughs> Your other, it's really weird. Acknowledge it. <laughs> no, 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 no! Don't do it right now. No, no, what no, no, no. I'm stuck. No, 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 no! <laughs> I'm saying, like, as soon as you look to your, like, as soon as you step back and look at your face, like, it's gone. It's just, it's because when you're looking at the other, like, your both of your pupils are looking that way. It's just a weird, it's just a weird thing. Oh, man. It's a cool skill to show, you know. When no, it's mm. not a skill. I'm not talking about a skill. <laughs> No, but I think it's, it's a cool skill. Oh, no, it's not a skill. <laughs> that I don't have. No, it's... Just, you I know... can wiggle my ears. Because I can't have to wiggle my ears. It's cute. Wiggle ears. That's, that's I guess, like somewhat ears? of a skill. Yeah. It's not as cool as making your eyes purposely cross-eyed, but... Mm. Is it criss-cross-eyed? How do you say uh, that? I don't know. <laughs> Mume is the... <laughs> <laughs> Have your eyes like DIY different googly directions. eyes. <laughs> Mume can watch your front and your back at the same time. Mume she is, is the, the paragon <laughs> of human ano anatomy curiosity. <laughs> Anato anatomy. Mume anatomy. can watch your six and your twelve. <laughs> 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 did, did you girls ever like experience? I think it was. It only happened during like school time some kids would like try to impress you like hey look at this skill that i have and they yeah. would like pull over their eyelids the top eyelids it's <laughs> 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 so disgusting oh i'd have people like they'd roll their eyes back or something <laughs> i had a girl who told me that she could belly the white of her eyes like, this is not what? even girls talk man <laughs> what are we doing <laughs> She was like, she was like, look at this, can oh. you do this girl? And she lifted her shirt and she went like, like, <laughs> blah, 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 with her stomach. It was weird. Was it like belly, belly dancing? dancing? I don't know, but it was. I mean, her belly was dancing, I guess. I didn't see one who could roll their stomach too. Whoa. We should mm. take a belly dancing class. No. Oh, Aki, you know, sometimes <laughs> I can teach us. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you can wear the loud skirts to like, they go. Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. Okay, are you girls ready for another picture? Yes. yes. I think we're not. <laughs> oh no. Oh, that's for your nails. Is it? It's right. I would. I no. Well, I've seen it before. I, yeah. I think it's not for I the have nail front part. Is it for like the back part? Yeah, it's like I like that skin in your cuticles and stuff. Yeah, right? yeah. push but it back. The thing is, it mm -hmm. also looks like a scalpel, right? Yeah, the chat is like does... scalpel. <laughs> I guess it's... No. No! You say scalpel for any... <laughs> Scalp... <laughs> scalpel. Scalp... <laughs> yeah, because in German you say scalpel. The same word, <laughs> but it's pronounced the, the P-E-L. Yeah. Sounds fancy. 
<laughs> Fucking hell! But um, uh, you you basically with the middle part, you like what? You you try to rub off the the. the I feel Wait, like I was making my nails bleed. I didn't think about the middle part having a function. I don't know what it, it does. does. I thought that was just for grip. No. That's what I would assume no. too, because it's like if you have just smooth metal, it's gonna get slippery real fast. No, no, it is a, f it has a filing function, but Ooh. not. F I don't think yeah. it's usually used for the front. I think it's actually, you know, because the whole thing is for, like, what do you call it, the cuticles. Oh yeah. It's yeah. Not for the grip, because then they could just make it with plastic or whatever. But I, you only ever see it with this, um, you know, whole met, this whole thing in metal. It's like a file. That part is like a file. I'm I guess not pretty yeah, sure. Maybe it is a file too. But then, it's how not... do you not make your fingers bleed? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, it looks it. painful. I like I have to shed nail some file. blood for some nice nails. True. <laughs> Beauty is pain. Mm -hmm. Okay, this one I guess was too easy. But here's the last one. I honestly, it, Guda, if you get this, then honestly, you can be a permanent member of Ghost Talk. <laughs> Uh oh. <laughs> oh no. I, but, but maybe. Well, if you know, if this is also nail related, and you know a lot of things about nails, then you probably do know. I don't know though. Uh, what is this? <laughs> they look like wasp nest. I, I, I can imagine what it could be. Well, not I right now. We don't is. know for sure what it is. Do you know what it is? I think so. Yeah. What do you think it is? Do I say or do I wait for Mume? Because I don't wanna. Mume doesn't know anything. Oh, no. <laughs> Mume <Why>? never knows. <laughs> I see it in her eyes. I don't know. Like personally, I would think maybe these are probably like fingertip sized, and they're you put your fingers in. Probably I never saw it in action, but I would assume. And then, and then, yeah. Mm, like, well, then middle? I don't know. You soak them in acetone, like <gasps> what Mubei was trying to do. It's like little fingertip nail Wait, soaker oh, thing. The one I used came with the foil. Oh. Oh. Is it for okay. nail care? Why is it separate? Where's your pile of them? Because there's many. For each of your little fingers. But... Maybe? Uh, that's what I think it is. Wait, if this Na is also nail you related, I need to get something that's not nail related. <laughs> Wait, let me fact check that. Wait. Mm -hmm. Individual. Because you do soak, like, you soak some cotton around it and then you're supposed to wrap foil or plastic. Oh. Okay. Gura. Ah. Uh. Gura, what is. What is. Okay, wait, I have to save it differently. I, I, I think that I know what it is. Maybe you what? don't know what. Although you probably know what it is. Uh, wait. Is that what this is though? They look like yeah, little alien eggs or something. Okay. <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. Spider eggs or so. Uh. Stick them in your nose. Soak off <laughs> nail cap for for huh? a bloody nose. Yeah, you can like hide stuff in them too, like a little pocket, <laughs> extra pocket <laughs> accessory. Okay, good. Uh, look, I challenge you. I'm looking. Do you know what this is? You probably don't need it, but do you know what this is? Those are nipple covers. <laughs> yeah. Okay, too Patties. easy, too easy. I knew too what easy. those were too. <laughs> yeah. God damn it, no one's too easy. Because I used to always get like ads for them. <laughs> like wish.com. <laughs> <laughs> mm, okay. Okay, okay, okay. How, how, how about... <laughs> this one. This one you will not know. Mm. Okay, uh. here it comes. Are you ready? You won't know this one. Ta da! What is this? It's blurry. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> the, the screen quality is makes it a bit difficult. You don't. Too. You're not supposed to read what it says because oh, that gives okay. it away. It looks like a lifesaver. It does look like a lifesaver. <laughs> yeah, like a little silicone thingy. Mm-hmm. Looks like silicone-y. It looks like his hand. Is this makeup related or are you pulling a funny? Can you make it a little bigger? It looks like... Mm. It also reminds me of thick tape. <laughs> mm. Well... Uh. <laughs> 
Yeah, I'd like to know if there's something in like what's inside. It looks like a bagel. It's it's it is it is weird. I actually have never seen it before myself either. And I'm sure. It it was on you know <laughs> a, a website that has a like uh, only girls know these items, but turns out this is a trick question. <laughs> what is it? It it's a it's not really a girl's item. Wait. Yeah. Is it like a waffle maker but for <laughs> bagels? <gasps> no. <Ooh. laughs> no. It's it's a corn cob decorner. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Thing. It looks so tiny, there. doesn't it? But apparently you put yeah. the corn through there. What? I guess. If you yeah. look closely, there's a, even a little image on on the. <laughs> oh my god! It is yeah. weird. Oh, why? Why? Know. You can just use a knife. What? It's one of those tools, you know, kitchen life hack tools. I mean, maybe if you like have trouble holding knives and stuff, like I can see it being useful. But if you have no issue, mm. you know, with that type of stuff, why? <laughs> well, yeah, I wouldn't well, have. Maybe, I wouldn't well, maybe need it this. for that. Maybe it does exist for like if you have shaky hands or like a tremor or something. Well, yeah, mm. if you have a tendency to cut uh, yourself accidentally with the knife in the kitchen, yeah. Mm. Oh, oh, wait. The cool thing about this is apparently. If I look closely, it says align top at on the top, slide down and then pour out, which means it kind of collects the corn seeds. Oh. Whoa! But <laughs> well, who needs this? No one. I <laughs> never make. I never prepare corn. Oh, why not? You should. Corn I don't is know. good. Like it's easy to prepare, but for some reason, like mm. I don't know. I just think, why? I don't mm. know. And just buy it in the can. It's yeah. Easy that way. Yeah, I guess I so. Just, just don't eat corn. I guess none of the meals I make really call for corn, too. Oh, You should try corn cob pizza like I made before. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> anyway. Oh, I know what that is. Hmm. What? Gura scent? What's oh. that? Isn't that for your face? For your, like, ah. uh, like, for your cleanser? Or something to really get no. close. It's not. Is it for your feet? It's, no. It's. I know what is it, it is. For... Is it for? Oh, is it for your hair? Is it for your hair? Kind of. Yeah. Right. To, yeah. To lather. To lather yeah. the shampoo. Yeah. It's a scalp exfoliator. Mm -hmm. <laughs> get the dirt off your scalp. Wash it with this. I guess. Uh... Well, I wouldn't use it though. Good. Do you use this? No, it kind of hurts. I tried it before. Ooh. I wonder how <laughs> dirty my scalp is. Mm. <gasps> well, they say, do you guys know? Ah, do you know your hair brushes? Ladies. Oh, <laughs> probably a lot of um, shit on there. <laughs> this, this, this is everybody. If you have hair, if you have hair, this just pertains to you. Uh, apparently, if you look at your hairbrush after a while, it might get like white fuzzies on here. Like, oh, it's yeah, the lint. It's like dust. Uh -huh. Apparently, yeah. that's like oils and stuff that you need to wash off. That's like bacteria and ick hmm. and skin that has collected. And they say that once that starts appearing on your hairbrush, you need to start. You need to like soak it or disinfect your hairbrush. Okay. I don't oh. know if that's true. Huh. That's scary. Well, I'll, I was just uh, pulling it off. I remember I once. Yeah. Me too. Once I was um using <laughs> using my mom's hairbrush. Uh -huh. And it immediately and like I I don't. It's not that I wasn't supposed to. I just didn't want her to know. And <laughs> almost immediately, there's like that lint stuff. I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> like, oops. I was like trying to pick it up. But the more I tried picking it out, the worse it got. And I just put it back. And I was like, hopefully she won't notice. We may got dusty <laughs> hair. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. <laughs> hmm. oh. Well, don't... Don't worry about it. I think it's not... I mean, yeah, I believe that. But I don't think it's such a big deal... To worry about, you know. I used to have to use head and shoulders. Oh. When I was little, blue. I can't oh. wear black without the blue. Mm -hmm. Sorry, that was another mm -hmm. dandruff product. <laughs> oh! It appeared in my head. Head and shoulders, right? It's anti dandruff. Oh no, it's just good for like yeah. itchy, dry it, scalp. Mm, it's also anyway. anti dandruff. I went to camp and they had to give me head and shoulders. I was the only one who got head and shoulders. Oh! A bear. That's okay though. Did you get the green <laughs> apple scent? 
look. No. Oh. I got like a two-in-one oh. shampoo, <laughs> conditioner. Oh, Aww, it's okay. It's okay, Lume. Don't worry about it. Those times are over anyway. And now, that not probably now, those kids are using um, those products themselves, you know? It's oh, okay. They're bald. They don't even it's have okay. hair. They didn't tell, they didn't tell them. <laughs> oh, only I, only I do. Oh, well, you know, that's nice, I guess, that I didn't tell them. It worked. Mm. My dandruff went away. Yay! Well, congratulations. Dandruff. Goodbye, dandruff. I wonder if it was... Could it have been because like I was in the sun and maybe my head was getting like mm. burned? Possible. Yeah, feeling. your scalp can burn if you're not careful. It hurts. Mm. I don't know how that happens. Mm. Well, you gotta never do What is that? Uh, uh -huh. Excuse me. <laughs> uh, no, no, okay. Yeah, I, I mean, you, this is a, probably a hair curling tool, I would say. You smell it! Yeah. Oh. Boil it before you even show could it! Have, could have. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you guys curl your hair? Um, I'm not a curl hair. <laughs> uh, 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 I, I would like to... Um, oh. Actually, I'm really bad at curling my hair. So, uh, I'm very interested in a, in, a, in a new product that has... A <laughs> that has arrived on the market. Have you girls heard? Of this uh, like Dyson air curling thingy, a Dyson air wrap. Yes, I think of I have. You know. Yes, is it? Wait, is it what I'm thinking of? It's like it's I... like this, this 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 void, this hole, this black <laughs> hole. Like it's just a it's just a circle that's in and it's empty, and you it pulls air, or it pulls your hair in, and it just whoosh, 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 you know, like a lottery ball uh. machine, basically. <laughs> I got my Dyson in uh twenty twenty one. Yes, I love it very much. I can show you like before and after oh. pictures if you want to see. But the Dyson, I have a vacuum. But I, I, I can vacuum <laughs> wait, it, it, yeah, they make hair styling products now. It, mm. so it straightens hair. Or can you use it to curl hair? It, it can yeah. curl. Yes, it can do everything. And there's like the so there's this base apparently, and then you then you buy like like extras that you put on the base, right, Guna? Yeah, mm. you can. It's got like a bunch of new attachments as well. They have like mm -hmm. an anti frizz attachment. Mm. You can do curls. You can do. Uh, you can straighten it if you want. Have you done yeah. curls with it yet, Gooby I've tried, but they don't really stick. I don't think I do it right. Either that, yeah. or I just have to use an iron for Even it. Even though I don't own uh, it, I, I I watched a tutorial on how to curl your hair properly with the Dyson. Oh. And and you just yeah you gotta figure it out. And then apparently it's really easy, but oh. well, it makes cool it's curls. Really nice, but you have to make sure that your hair is li always listen to the instructions. They say like eighty percent dry because mm, I think I, I used am. it. I think huh? I used it when my hair was too wet and I was missing like a chunk of hair because oh, I think it just broke off. Holy shit. Uh, how do you know when it's 80%? What? Yeah, right? Uh, like, oh, that's uh, difficult. Uh, like, yeah, but it's just almost dry. <laughs> just dry. Just yeah. almost dry. Oh, okay. Hmm. Well, if it's drier than um, wet, then you'll be fine. Mm. Sounds risky. <laughs> Plus, you can always re moisten it, I think. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Remoist, just throw some water. Yeah, I think so. Oh. Make your hands wet and then go through your hair. I think that would work. But oh. it also makes you really sweaty because it gets hot. Because it's blowing hot air on you. So, mm. so interesting. I want to try it out. I want to try the curling thingy out. Because I actually... I don't... I have a curler for my hair. But I, I don't ever use it when I want to curl my hair. The only thing I can succeed in curling my hair with is a straightening iron, ironically. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've seen that. Mm. I just go like... Um, there's like two two strategies. You can either do like a wave, you know, or oh. you can wrap it around the straightening iron and then just pull it down. That works. Yeah. <laughs> ironically, ironically, for straightening my no, for curling my hair, I use a straightening iron. Ironically, <laughs> a master of the iron because that can be tricky to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, I got the skills. I do want to. <laughs> Oh, okay. One more thing that I want to talk about that Guda brought up uh, or brought with her 
that I I want to hear from you girls and talk about is what color theme was your bedroom as a kid? Yeah, like what was your bedroom theme? If you had one, or maybe you had several. Can can I go first? Yeah. Okay, so my room. I was so happy once. Um, I have a brother. I was so happy once I got my own room and separated with my brother. <laughs> So then I made it my own room and my mom helped me paint my whole room in like a pastel, a little bit darker than pastel purple. Yeah. Cute. Ooh, lavender? Purple. Yeah, like oh. a lavender color. <laughs> I didn't want it pink. And um, yeah, so I went with purple. Purple is one of my favorite colors. And then and then, you know, I had this like this um this bed that was not not a fancy bed you know we did we were we weren't a wealthy family but I wanted it to look cute and my mommy made my dream come true of like you know a bed with those like we call it a himmelbett in German like a bed with curtains oh, oh princess bed yeah yeah yeah, yeah. So we got that. We made that uh, DIY around my bed. Yeah, canopy bed, I guess. Uh, yeah. mm. I like I like the the way I tried how oh. to make my room girly. But then one thing, this was during a fa during a time where I was starting my job. I love Japan face, my weeaboo face, and oh. <laughs> <laughs> I got like a lot of like things from Japan, and I would. I would stick because I was I, f I wanted to feel like I was in Japan or I was more Japanese or so. So I would stick all kinds of things like um, like Japanese snacks. I would stick it on my wall with tape. <laughs> like the wrappers after? No, it's still uh, there was still stuff inside. I would stick oh, it. What? Yeah. yeah, I wouldn't even eat it. I would just stick it on the wall. <laughs> and I I stuck like some like Japanese style clothes on my wall, and I stuck. I had this one big empty wall, and I stuck everything on there. And I got like a million uh like Japanese alpaca plushies, the cute ones. Oh, really cool. Yeah. And and what else? I oh, yeah, I got like really fancy Japanese calligraphy writing things that are stuck on my wall. Everything that's what it was like my Japanese wall. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, but purple. It was purple. What about you girls? Amume? I'm trying to remember mine. <laughs> you don't remember? Well, I moved quite a bit, so it kind of changed. Oh. Hmm. I remember my walls were white. Mm. I do remember at one point, for some reason, like there were two twin beds in my room. Mm. Oh. Like, but they were never put together. So it's not like I had a bigger bed. Mm. It was just there. Mm. <laughs> Story <laughs> room. I think, oh, I think when I had like a sleepover or something, mm. they pushed it together. But I don't, I don't know why it was there. But, oh. um,. And that yes, was bed. pink. Oh, cute. Pink. But no one ever stayed in my room. No. <laughs> Wait, the, the beds were pink? Yeah, it was like pink and white, I think. Mm. Was it a bed for I... your stuffed animals? Where did, I put... where did I put my stuffed animals? I had a lot. I don't know. Mm. I don't remember. But I do. Okay, I do remember. Oh my gosh. No, okay, I remember something. A different place where I lived. I had one. Uh, one twin bed and the room was pretty small mm. and so I think the only other thing in there was my dresser mm -hmm. and there was a closet and my bed was kind of in the middle of mm. the room but it was really small so there's just like a little space on the other side mm -hmm. so I think on the right was the door and the left is where I put all my stuffed animals and it was just like <laughs> stuffed it was just an ocean of stuffed animals oh, heaven. on the left on the left side of my bed I remember. Oh, I had a bookshelf mm. there too. But it was pink. It was usually white and pink, but very colorful Cute. with all the stuffed animals. But once, once I got lice, and, oh. then, and then we found, or no, we found ants or something on one of my stuffed animals, and so we had to like clean all of them. And I had a lot. Oh, oh I remember that. Ants or lice? I I remember it looking like ants, but really? but. 
Maybe it was paralyzed. Yeah? I used to I have lies know. too, and I got bullied so much in school for it. And then people, the girl that nobody wanted to be friends with me, cause I, what? I was the lie skin. What? I, I need to confess, I, I never no. could talk about this, but I was the lie skin for a long time, and me and my mom tried so hard to get rid of it. Like she would, we would experiment every single thing. We would at one time, you know, the normal lice things they didn't work. Oh. The normal lice shampoos and all that, mm. and you know the mm. the the um comb, the really oh, tight comb. Yeah. That really hurt. Nothing worked. One time we tried this. We bought this like heat cap, heat helmet that you put oh. on top. It gets so yeah. fucking hot and you try to burn them. That didn't work either. I, I tried, I swear, everything. And whenever I would go to school and they would like a student would find something, they would like tell the teacher and then they would tell me to go home. And then obviously everybody knows. And then me and my mom would try again for like a week to get rid of it, but... Mm, it's kind of questionable oh. if it really ever got rid of it, but I would have to go back eventually and they would think... Oh, maybe now she's... she's done. But next time it was again me and... <laughs> mm. Life is a bitch. It was That's really traumatic it. for mm. me. That's if it terrible. makes you feel better, I had lice like five times. Like five separate times, but... I think when I got it, it was usually in the summer, so there wasn't school. Mm. So that just means you guys were really clean, right? Cleanly children. Really? Oh yeah, because they only <laughs> go, they only go for clean heads. Yeah. Uh, they they won't oh, because go lice on dirty clean heads. heads or what? No, lice don't like dirty dirty heads. Oh. Okay. <laughs> but I, I was in dirt balls, so I never had lice. Mm. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I was the crusty kid, so. <laughs> I think this means you guys were clean and then cleanly and the lice were like... I don't think that's the image lice. that the other kids got. If anything, they all wanted to keep distance from me. Nobody wanted to hug me and, you know, nobody wanted Aww. to sit next kids to me. stupid. They were um, ignorant. They didn't understand lice. No. Mm. I remember once I was in the car. I don't know why, but my <laughs> mom took me to the doctor when I first got lice. I think she was like in panic mode. Like, what do I do about this? So, I was on the way to the doctor and I remember itching my head and then I was like... I, I don't know, there's like kind of like dandruff or something under my nails. So I like wiped my nails on the oh. car seat and then the stuff under my nails oh, no. started moving. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I like yeah, killing yeah. them though. At some point, you know... I had so much hate towards them. So when I would pick one off of my head, I would like... S smash them with my <laughs> nails and kill them. Yeah. Yes. That made me happy. Oh, what am I thinking of? In some cartoon, <laughs> there was like a like I've seen a clip where there's like a lice. Hmm. What was it? There was like a it was showing like this like lice living in a civilization on someone's head and like ah, doing oh and it was, they, like like one had a family. I think it focused on one and then later on like you know people use the shampoo and then it was like a horrible. It was like an <laughs> apocalypse for them. <laughs> oh my god! What is that from? The civilization oh, I thing, no, that was something that was in my head too when I was younger. Like, I was wondering, like, there's so many up there. They're so tiny. My head is so big. It must be, like, a world for them. Like, I'm Earth. I am their Earth. <laughs> mm. well, That's okay. true. You are you are their entire ecosystem. Yeah. Your scalp and all of its goodies. Yeah, yeah. Well, but then the, I eventually... I just got rid of them, like, like naturally by growing older. It seems like they prefer children. Because kids are... Mm. Why is that? Why do... Maybe it like us at any age? I wonder if... When you're younger, your hair is usually a bit thinner, right? Mm, maybe it's maybe? healthier? Maybe? Or, well, how, I guess it depends how young. Mm. I don't know. They mm -hmm. just disappeared at some point after many years of suffering with it. Good. But, you didn't I tell mean, us though about your color theme. Oh yeah. Oh, I was a uh, blue, light blue, blue, brown, really? green, blue, brown, green, blue, blue, black, blue, blue, black. Yeah, polka dots. Did, did you request it or I did? <gasps> oh. But I always wanted uh like pink. Pink. Oh. I wanted like a hot pink room. Why is it not? <laughs> did they not? Did your parents not allow it or? Oh no, I 
I just, I always wanted, like, a different theme. Like, I would look through the magazines. I would come through the mail and, like, used to have, like, mm. uh, like, like the Pottery Barn Kids magazines. And they had the perfectly themed kid rooms. Like, this girl had lavender and hearts. And this one was pink with zebra stripes. And this one mm. was this. And I had the really cool loft beds. I would be like, oh, I want this. I used to have a loft bed. Oh, who, jealous. Who was loft beds, gang? Only me? <gasps> it's so cool because, well, we, we had to... Safe space, especially when I was still <gasps> living with my brother. And I had my computer mm. underneath. Hey. Oh, cool. Yeah. Mm. But so I would, I would like, uh, at, uh, late at night, you know, I, I, my mom is a gamer, so she kind of raised us <laughs> as gamers. So I got a PC very yeah. early. I, I, don't, I can't remember, but probably already when I was like 10 or 9. And back then, it wasn't normal for a kid to have a computer. But I had it. And then like late shared. at night... You have a shared computer. Oh, right? I have my own head. Oh, what? Yeah. And then what? especially during like um, summer holidays, summer vacation from school, I would like get so addicted to uh, anime MMORPGs and I would like play 10 to 15 hours a day <laughs> grinding and leveling and then uh, at like 3 a.m. or so. Or not, no, sometimes when my mom would wake up at like 7 a.m. I would be still awake playing and I noticed that she would get up because oh. her alarm would start ringing and I was like, shit, 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 okay. So I, <laughs> I instead of turning off my PC because that takes so much time, I would just turn off the monitor and quickly climb up to my bed oh. and act as if I'm sleeping. <laughs> That's like master level of hide the DS. Yeah. Sometimes had she a... would notice, sometimes she wouldn't. Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> uh, once I got like a laptop, mm. like my first, or, yeah, a laptop for the first time, I would take my bamboo tablet and draw like in bed. So I'd ah, have the, ban the bamboo, bamboo tablet you mean the, the on the cheap keyboard. wacko one? Yeah, 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 mm -hmm. yeah. Like, mm -hmm. And uh, so I also had to be stealthy because I'd stay up way too late drawing on the computer. And somehow I would like, if I, like, I don't know if, someone was coming up like upstairs or like I, I could just tell mm. and I'd hide my entire laptop under my pillow. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> hot, hot overheating. <laughs> oh yeah, I'd keep my yeah, it'd be warm. <laughs> Very warm. I used to have a bamboo uh, too. That was my first I think my first uh drawing tablet. Yeah, it was my first the one too. bamboo. Mm -hmm. Had a pink one. I was so happy First I had a cheap uh, white one, and then later I, I upgraded to a pink one, and I was so happy because it was so cute. There's a pink one. Uh, yeah. Didn't really pay with pink. There was a pink one, and it made drawing so much more fun because it was pink. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch. I just I remember saving up for it, mm. and it taking so long. And like, how expensive were they? The bamboo. They were yeah, yeah, because 100. I think yeah, back then they were a hundred or so. Yeah, yeah, I remember saving up, and then once I had enough, I was just so like I don't know. It was like the greatest day of my life. Yes. <laughs> when yes, I yes. could buy one. Um, I kind of missed my bamboo. <laughs> right, so simple, yeah. so easy. Mm. Ah, you know what was also fun? Okay, now we're like not ki girls talk, but kids talk. But you remember those drawing thingies where you draw on like a tablet and it's like a tablet shape, and then you pull the handle down and it deletes it. Oh, like yeah, the, the, uh, magnet. Or the, the magnet, the magnet one. Yeah, I think so. Oh, yeah, I, like I love that. <laughs> I just, I just get you. Anti sketch, right? Etch a sketch. Etch a sketch. Yeah, I think that's what I mean. Yeah, I love that. <laughs> yeah. Oh wait, are these? Oh. Mm -hmm. Why can't I copy paste them? I call. I call them. I call them etch a sketch. I'm not sure what I call them. Etch a sketch is the little, the little screwy things on the side, right? The little. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how you draw with it. Mhm, mhm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is. Oh. Yeah. Cute. Good. What kind of bed did you have? Um, just a, a box spring and a mattress on top. A box spring? Damn. I never had like a, a bed bed. I always wanted like a princess bed or a loft bed, but my mom oh, yeah. said that princess beds are fire hazard, <laughs> and you yeah. can't have a. The other ones were too expensive, so I always just had like hmm. either a mattress on the floor or a mattress on a box spring. Oh, I feel like box. I think spring. mine was like that. Mine was. 
just on a box spring too. Well, yeah. To me, box spring I f is a pretty American thing. I feel like it's like more common in America. Here, box oh, spring yeah, is, is so fancy to me. It's like a really expensive thing. Box well, if you don't have a box spring underneath, and your your mattress is gonna sag in the middle. You're gonna get back no. problems. No. No. What do you mean? There oh are like ladder type of things that you put underneath. Yeah, that's the box. No, they don't. No, <laughs> no, that's different. Yeah? <laughs> huh? But box spring and what do you call the other normal beds? What do you call that? Latin. What? Was, yeah, box spring. That's different. This. Is it? That's why. Yeah, I mean, that's I that's calm, that's. Right? That's different. That's the box. That's yeah. That's the box. Yeah. Oh wait, that's not what I had. You put the mattress on top of that box. Mm -hmm. I had. I'm pretty sure you could see the springs. Wait. What did I have? Wait, box. Strings? If it's like open and you know you put the 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 slats there yourself, that's I think a different thing. That's like a basic, basic bed frame frame thing bed. Yes. Wait, box spring. Wait, chat. KFP, guess what? I don't know! <laughs> I think at what? some point I had, um, like something covering the. How do you call it? Like something covering over the mattress frame or whatever. Like like a quilt thing covering it, but not the quilt of my bed. Do you know what I'm talking about? Uh, yeah. Like a padded that thing? Often goes uh. on top of those kind of box spring beds. Yes. Not like a whole full size mattress, but a. Uh, a comforter, yeah. I think it's a comforter. A what? mattress topper. Mattress oh, a topper. Bed, a bed... No, 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 no. Not a mattress. A bed, bed skirt is what it's called. Bed skirt? Yeah, a bed skirt. Oh? Wait, a bed skirt hides the... The, the box bed. spring. <laughs> yes. Oh, maybe it was a box spring. I just remember it. <gasps> oh, so. pretty. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bed skirt. It hides. Cute. Oh, Are you cute? Cute. Cute. Cute, cuteness oh, points silly. up, up, up. Oh yes. But can also look, I don't know, very old-fashioned and old. <laughs> Green oh. bed. Yeah, I had oh, a quilt. <gasps> oh, not a hodo. I love, I love girly bedding. Oh. Me too. I, I, I like specifically ordered like Japanese bedding when I was a teenager. Because it has like all the frills everywhere around it and the ruffles and the lace. <laughs> it's oh, kind of annoying uh, to wash, but it's like, wow, so cute. When it's made, it's so cute. Mm -hmm. My last bedroom before like I left, you know, to spread my wings, mm -hmm. um, it was so boring. Because <laughs> okay. I hadn't, I just didn't do any imp I, I don't know, I didn't really care. Very much. Mm. It was like the entire room was white with gray carpet. That was it. Oh. oh. Well, that was well, it. Why not? Why not? My room's now. But I just heard someone's stomach. Just I like, heard his stomach. Good hungry. You guys probably didn't Sorry. hear that, but I I heard it. The chat didn't hear it, did you? It's okay. My stomach uh... grumbles all the time. <laughs> Someone's getting hungry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just... <laughs> I didn't mean to interrupt. I'm sorry. <laughs> no problem. Uh, one. Okay, one last thing. Uh, Speaking of food. Oh, good. Do you? Uh, <laughs> do you think? I feel. I feel like to me, avocados is a girly food. Do you agree? <gasps> Why you say that? I don't like avocados, but to me, it's like every girl these days eats avocados. Because <laughs> of the healthy fats, it's good for your I hair. I don't think it's a... I think like there's like avocado accessory stuff. That's a girl thing. But oh wait, I feel like... really offended. I'm not saying you're like a girl because you <laughs> eat an avocado. <laughs> and if so, then so what? It's healthy. It's good for you. It's the good mm. fat. <laughs> They're freaking out. No, I just mean, you know, I don't know. I see like girls nowadays are always eating avocados. Because it's a, a super food, a healthy mm. food. Mm -hmm. It's like a, it's, it became more popular like recently, don't you think? Like in the past I, three, four years? All I know is that boomers make fun of younger people for eating avocado. Because they've never had chipotle guacamole and that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> 
More for us. Screw them. <laughs> Live your life on knowing Wait, of the delicious Wait, guacamole is too salty. It's like it's too or not salty. It's too too much. What? Too much too much lemon. Is lime? I think it's lime. Lime, it's lime. No, not lemon. Lime. It's too much. Oh, I love it. I eat it with a spoon if I get my hands on it. Oh my! It like makes my mouth tingle. Like it feels weird. <gasps> Wait. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, um, I just thought of something. Hold on. Is it the boomer tumor thing? Boomer and then the boomer? Oh, I just know that boomer, like, I saw something about how boomers were like, oh, younger people don't know how to save money because they spend all their money on avocado. <laughs> That's because all they eat is Hormel chili. They need to <laughs> shut up. What the fuck is this, Gura? Sorry. What did you send? Oh, that. But we said that lime or citrusy makes her mouth tingle and made me think of this uh, totally not TikTok that I saw and totally not Instagram. <laughs> but they were like, this is why pineapple makes your mouth tingle, which I'm assuming is maybe similar because pineapple under ah. a microscope has needles and it stabs ah. inside your mouth and that's why what? your mouth tingles. We need pineapple. Ah. What? Is it? Did what? you know? Wait, yeah. now I'm, I'm second guessing myself. Am I thinking of? Chipotle guacamole? Maybe. I don't know. I I think I am. Maybe it also depends, like, you know, different restaurants have different. What the fuck? Probably. Digestive enzymes is what it is. Apparently. Eww. Stabby stabby. Mm. <laughs> no, no needles. They have is digestive it? enzymes. It's the fruit that eats you back. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I assumed it was like just because it's acidic, like cit citrus. Yeah, not citrus, I thought but so I, that's too. What I thought. Don't it's believe funny. everything on the internet, Gooby Diba. But it's so easy. <laughs> well, well, well. Any any last girl uh, words? Anything you want to leave? I think we're going overboard with avocados because you can find avocados in everything now. It's like health food. You can make pudding. You can make mm -hmm. uh, ice cream with avocado. You oh, yeah! Avocado Actually, ice cream. Mm. the cottage cheese. That's what people are latching on to uh. now. Have you seen that? Cottage oh, cheese. Oh, yeah, I have seen dough. people... People are replacing cottage, like, <gasps> yogurt with cottage cheese. The cottage cheese ice cream. Wait, what? No, I you know blend that. it up and then you add your stuff into it, but cottage cheese is like salty and... Yeah! Goopy. Mm. Food Sorry. world just... is very different <laughs> over there than from here. <laughs> I don't well, see like I've, cottage I've cheese. I've never heard people. of this. What? <laughs> Me neither. Where? <laughs> Guda, honestly, I feel like you... you... You live in a different world, like, you know too many things, and... I am well, permanently <laughs> online. Yeah, yeah. See, that's what I was thinking. Like, when I see trends and stuff, like, it's online. Because I don't know what people do around me. <laughs> so, it's mm. all online. Like, yeah. oh, I guess this is what the, the young people are up to. Oh, this mm -hmm. is what the old people are doing now. Oh. Mm. <laughs> but, oh. Then, but then Guna will look at these things, and I feel like you, you, you think, like, it's like a big thing everywhere. And, or so, <laughs> but that's it's my little just world. really niche, yeah. <laughs> Especially the okay, 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 la 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 oh. thing. Like no one probably, maybe the kids. <laughs> yeah, no one, no, no one knows. Kids. Does anybody in the chat know about that anyway? Probably not. Is anybody in this chat under the age of sixteen though? That's the question. Because that may be, <laughs> that may be a big. No, no, nope. no, no. I mean, I mean, I don't know. We don't know which answer, which question they're answering, but <laughs> I mean, you said up and coming, so maybe, maybe it's you know, it's coming. It, no. I, I believe it is. No, <laughs> no, <laughs> no. In fact, I'm happy. Okay. It's not coming. It's not. I'm happy. It's, I'll go it's... my cottage cheese alone then. <laughs> A cottage cheese is nice though. It is nice. It is nice. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, <laughs> girls. Ah, uh, should probably leave it around that. It was nice oh, talking oh, to oh. girls. Yes? Oh, I have a girly thing to say. Yes. Ah. Let's go to the bathroom together. <laughs> <gasps> okay. 
I have sure. to go to the bathroom. Come with me. Oh, wait, I have a question. Oh, Cat to the bathroom. How to go it's to the topic. bathroom? No, no. Uh, this is girl girl code. We go to the bathroom together, but do you do you guys think it's okay to talk to one another while you're in the stall? Yes or no? It or does conversation stop when the door closes and we're all doing our thing? I think it's, I think it's more awkward if it's just silent. It, okay. It depends. And it then, depends. Most of the time, I think it's too embarrassing and, and, and awkward <laughs> and no. But... Uh, I've also tried the conversation path. And... Uh, Mm. Yeah, it depends. It's a difficult thing. <laughs> I think it depends. Like, I will not start conversation. Like, I've, I don't know. I've had girlfriends where like we'd go and it'd be silent, or I had some that like would immediately start talking. Just <laughs> 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 I just I respond. Yeah. When when someone does th does that, I'm like. I respect you for being so comfortable in this room right now while we're hearing all these noises. <laughs> I respect that, like, wow. <laughs> I went to the bathroom with a HoloLive member and we chatted in between the stalls, no problem. Well, who was it? Japanese member? Uh, no, it was, it was an English member. Yeah, member. Uh, who was it? You know, I don't know if I should say it because I don't want them to be embarrassed if that's not something <laughs> they want me to share, but. I'm oh. okay with chatting. Oh. I don't mind. Oh. Okay. So. <laughs> okay. Hmm. That's interesting. I was just curious because I don't know. We go to the bathroom know. together, but then I don't know. Conversation continues oh. or stops. <laughs> I have something I won't say on stream, but remind me. To, 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 okay. To, to mention. I want to see if you guys do it too. Oh, okay. <laughs> The, the, the real girls talk happens after the girls talk because there's, you know, girls things that we can really only discuss under, uh, you know, the circle. This circle, you know, private mm. circle of girls. Top secret. Yes, top secret. <laughs> <laughs> there's like, I don't know, there's things that you want to share about girls where it's like, yeah, you know what, I feel like, like, like guys, guys just like, you know, they can know this. They can know this. That's not weird. Yeah. But then there's other things where I'm like, this is like, if if guys, no, no, they're gonna twist this. They're gonna be weird. So well, we can't tell <laughs> them because then the girl code will be broken, and then we're gonna oh, disappear in the dead of night, oh, and we code, can't have that. Code. Well, for by the way, for the next oh. girls talk, I'm planning something. If if the girls are up for it. What I want to do next is I want to have uh, every participating member write anonymously to an anonymous person a love letter <laughs> in a situation Ooh. that is like provided by me, like you know, um, to you know see which anonymous letter is the most doki doki inducing one will be voted by the chat and maybe also the members who are then there and then after the most doki doki one has been chosen we will only after that find out who wrote what <laughs> letter <laughs> oh. <laughs> who writes the best love letters <laughs> oh. can we use chat gpt no <laughs> <laughs> write me no. love letter you have to use your heart can you oh. do that <laughs> I don't think I can do it and have it not obvious it's me. You gotta be... <laughs> you gotta stay anonymous, Mumi. Mm, okay, okay. And maybe, good if you want, you can always be on again. <laughs> I was gonna say, I don't know if I'm included in this, but I'm gonna watch regardless. So. <laughs> <laughs> ChatGPT is a great writer for a love letter. Oh, I don't recommend it. Mm, ChatGPT okay. has a heart. No. I won't, I won't use it as anything. I won't reference or get any ideas from it. Nope. Okay. Good. Ah! What was that wink? I saw that. No, I have something in my eyes. I Sorry. saw another wink. Ah! <laughs> is it your eyes going crazy again? One thing is doing something different than the other? It's my contacts. It's, it's <laughs> funny. Better take him out. Better get your eyes lasered, Mumi. I want out! <laughs> Laser vision. Ah, well, mm -hmm. Guna, did you have fun being a girl today? I did, thank you guys for, uh, having me. You're welcome!
Welcome. Thanks for coming to my room. I learned a lot. I did too. Yeah. Kura is such a girl. She knows so much about nails, especially. Mm-hmm. When we have questions about nails, Mume, I think we got to go to Goobity Bomb. Uh-oh. My nails are cut. My nails are gross. Or Callie too. I feel like the most girly thing about Callie, for example, is her nails. She also is a big nail person. And she's a girly girl. She got the girly girl side. Mm-hmm. This is the Moe gap. Yes. You don't expect it, but when you get to know her, you notice, oh, she's very growing. <laughs> you gotta uncover it. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Who do you? Okay. One last question. Who do you think uh, is the girliest in from your POV? The, from your knowledge, who's the girliest uh, in EN? What do you think? Oh, of every EN? Hmm. Fauna. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fauna is yeah. Yeah, yeah, she she'd well, be very girly. <laughs> I, yeah, I Mumi, we haven't. Oh yeah, we're the only ones that haven't. <laughs> we... <laughs> well, I I could be wrong, but my gut's telling me Frana for what I know so far. No, um, it's not me. Don't, it's not me. Mumi, Gooba think... didn't meet. No, no, oh. not yet, not yet. Oops. <laughs> 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 Eh, wait, Kura. Aww. You met everyone but Mume? I think so. Oh, damn. Mm, I believe I've, so. I've met everyone but Kura. <laughs> oh. Uh, Mume they and Kura have never been other. in the same room. <laughs> they <laughs> they hate hate each uh, other. Oh, but you also the never in the same room argument. True, true, true. <laughs> <laughs> Which one is it? I wonder. <laughs> well, someday. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. Oh. That will be a magical, miraculous day when you two finally meet. It'll be odd. Ah, it'll be interesting yeah. to have, like to meet somebody because like, we sound so similar to like <laughs> talk to each other in the same room and hear it. Do you, does that make sense? Do you know what I mean? Yeah, but I, I'm one. I feel like people sound different in person. So mm. yes, there could be. Mm. Mm, but yes, mm. yes. Yeah. Oh. True. <laughs> I mean, Kiara, you've met both of us. Is it different in person? Um, I mean, I can generally, what? like, even now, clearly make a distinction. It's just like oh, sometimes. Oh, I mean, different you know? from how we sound online, not from oh. each other. Like, like oh. how we sound online. Mm. Mm. Not much. I think it's mostly like a mood thing, like IRL. Mostly oh. we're like, you know, more like chill, you know? So mm. then the mood maybe brings it down a little bit, but mm. I, I don't think it's much different. Mm. No. I think Fana got Mume and I confused uh, the other <laughs> day when we were together because I think either I said something or. or how did it happen? But on what Discord? Is on Discord? Um, yeah. I noise. I think it was just a noise. It was a noise, but yeah. It was funny. Naruto? Naruto? Yeah, it's, it's just, just it's like just from the stars align. It's uh, very. Yeah. It's like, yeah. <laughs> mm, ah, mm. Minecraft. Ah. Was it doing Minecraft? Yeah, you were there. Right before. I was probably doing Minecraft, yeah. And m yeah. probably more, more times. Other times too. But uh, I, it's just small, small moments, I think. So when you mm, make, yeah. when you say a whole sentence, I think you, you can tell it apart. If you can't, you're deaf. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ah, oh. ah! People told me before that I, uh, my, me with my old microphone apparently sounded. A little bit like Iris. <gasps> I've heard uh, that from a couple uh -huh. people, but don't know. I'm gonna have to see a comparison video. Mm. To... I don't Let's think there's see. a comparison video, but some people said that. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I sounded very different with my old microphone. That's a fact. It's been a long time since I used it. Mm. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Iris, it's Kiaris. Iris, it's Kiaris. Iris, it's Kiaris. Is that how it is? 
<laughs> Wait, you're actually I'm pretty. pretty I, I cannot. I cannot. <laughs> Im like impersonate. I never tried Iris before. for my life. <laughs> <laughs> but but that sounded pretty. That, uh -huh. was, that was kind of how she says it, doesn't? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Iris. It's Iris. Oh! But not like that. Not, not like that though. That was I don't good know. too. That was good. <laughs> I don't think I can like. I can't replicate how she normally talks. But the Iris is Iris. Like you hear that so much. Mm hmm. <laughs> I feel like it's easier. Yeah, certain phrases are easier. Hmm. Well, 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 well. Mm. Thank you. Thank you for the praise as well. Mm. So, thank you, girls. This will be the end of Girls Talk Gura. What are you looking oh. at? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm scrolling through your channel. I'm looking for your old, old videos for your mic. Sorry, 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 sorry. It's okay, it's okay. So, let's say our oh. goodbyes. Mm, goodbye. <gasps> goodbye. 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 <laughs> Thank you for listening, everybody, to the girls' talk. We'll do it again sometime. Bye, sisters. Oh. <laughs> Bye, sisters. Yeah. Bye, sisters. Oh, good on. Bye, siblings. Some people were looking forward to hearing your Valley Girl today. There was none. Too bad. I killed Valley Girl. No! She's dead. <laughs> <laughs> That's the last no. year. <laughs> oh, sad. So sad. Okay, bye bye guys. And in German we say Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen. Well, they try harder. Come on. Auf Wiedersehen. <laughs> She's mumbling. Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen. <laughs> Gremlin. <laughs> bye bye. We're gonna fall asleep under the kotatsu now. <laughs> Bye-bye. <laughs> 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 <laughs>